as a whole, as an alpha, like you take your nah, shit, you man. keep it stepping, uh, you keep it moving. Bruv, that whatever. is not healthy. I though. think it's that's what has an impact. Air COVID is airdrop. COVID is airdrop. Monkey monkeypox is we transfer. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Do you get it? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take from the next. Greek Don. <laughs> he. Yeah. <laughs> G. Was it Billie Eilish to go with a? Uh, Who's that? Yeah, that singer. Isn't it lovely? Sing another verse than you. Bro, like we're we're made to. Intel Mango. What? Tiggle? You're doing a tiggle. Man's got you like this and you're and you're yeah, the one yeah, friending him. Me, trust Allow me. it. Daddy. Hey, my boy. Chat to me. What's new? This one, mm. this episode, mm. it's a bit it's a bit deep end. It's not as lighthearted as the other one. Alright, what the seven faces faces thing? Yeah, and apparently it's forty faces. Yeah, I don't believe that. I don't know. Seven I'm, is bare like yeah, pushing yeah, seven, it. Seven yeah, yeah man. Yeah, yeah. People were like coming 40. with a if forty people look like me, that's mad. Hundred percent someone at least that I've crossed paths with would like mm. out like mm. receptionist at gym. Yeah. Like there's a high possibility that someone this local lives. This, yeah, no, no, I get that. That's what I'm saying. This, what I'm about to say now, I'm going to pause it a second. I just remember something. I'll, I'll forget, yeah? Okay. Apparently, if you ever dream about oh, someone yeah, I heard this. and you see, let's say, you see a face that you've never seen in your life, yeah. you actually have seen that person. Yeah. Listen, like, you, you, can't, can't, you can't dream about someone you've never seen. Well, no, you can't even think about a face that you've never seen. Say so swear. Yeah, you can't. You Try can't, and think yeah. of a face you've never seen before. That's a, You can't actually imagine a face. That you can't imagine seen. a face, G. That's actually the maddest, but yeah. I hear it. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird. Go ahead, anyway, brother. sorry. Anyways, so you lot probably gonna laugh at me, yeah, but I find this quite interesting. So the person you are right now, yeah, is the person apparently yeah. you would have felt safe with as a kid. <laughs> I was gonna make a nonce joke there, but <laughs> yeah, I know, no, no, no. When I first read it, but it was. Oh, one you of see them. my body made some weird feeling right there. You know? <laughs> yeah, I don't know why <laughs> mine as well. You know, should I say I it again? Something <laughs> going from my left shoulder. Hey, you look, you look, you look, just got a bit of a. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, let me say it again. The person you are right now is the person you would have felt safe with as a kid. Nah, I don't like that. <laughs> Gee, the way I am now. All right, let me let me. No, 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 bro. Wait, wait, wait. Right. One sec, one sec. All safe. Right, doesn't not, not not safe as in oh, like hold my hand as I cross the road. Safe. Yeah, yeah no, no, no one's getting touched like that. But listen, no, no, listen, listen. If me, you know how I am. Yeah. If I met me as a kid when I'm fat, I would have had a field day, G. Oh would my you, wait, lord! Wait, wait, wait. What do you I would have had a field day. What do you mean? The the roasts I could have come up with Ooh. to that little fat blob. Oh my life! No way! That can't be true, bro. You, that can't be true, <laughs> bro. In this, in uh, okay, okay, cool. Like I'm, I'm, I'm being like no, no, no. A, a me as a kid. Wait, me as a kid, I would hate to be around someone who could have potentially potentially taken the piss out of me. Like to be fair, wait, but though, why is the only what? So you're trying to say you as a 25 year old today, yeah. <laughs> the only one highlight you have yeah. is you taking a piss out of your younger fat self. That's a bit of a mad thing to like focus on. If I on. meet a fat youth right now and he's bare fat, chances are I'll be kind to him. But when he's walking up, I'll be like, bro, you're <laughs> no, that's the you're that's fat. That's why are you jiggling? Are you saying coming? I this or like as hey, you walk, spot them, spot them. I'd be like my dog, you know. I do you know why? Because no, do you know Because I used to be fat. Like, as well, shops, you I used to be a fat blob as well. I used to be. Fat. That's what I'm saying. I was overweight, to bro. Be fair, I was nah, nah, to be fair, I am. I, I've got emotional intelligence. I think I've got empathy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would be get, nice. Yeah, I, would be, empathy, I would be rude. Well, it depends who we're. Uh, That's true. If yeah, I know you enough, yeah, but yeah. I think I would be rude if he walked off. Like maybe if he walked off, <laughs> like, bro, them love, love handles are moving mad. You know, <laughs> this guy's deep. No, no, the kid's like 12 years but old. I'm, Haram, but bro. I'm <laughs> He's just been eating what his mom gave him. It's fucked out here, man. This guy went through a weight loss journey and everything, and now he's the one. Now he's taking the he, piss of it. No, 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 it I, 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 I don't I care anymore. It's not choice. me anymore. <laughs> nah, I'm going Trust back me. though. I'm getting fat again, bro. I need to chill. Nah, nah, I'm nah, nah. Nah, nah. nah but in the sense of like who you are as a person, as your characteristics, like yeah. how you are as a man, as an individual. Yeah, I hear that. You know, I hear like, that. I think um, when they use the word safe, mm. that's why I was a bit. Mm. I don't know how I feel about that, but I get the concept, as in like rating like the person who i'd aspire yeah, yeah, to be yeah like, i look back at my like i'm 26 now so mm. if i if i met my 20 if i met my 16 year old self now i I would be like okay cool i'm i'm happy yeah i yeah, became yeah i hear that i, say. I hear that obviously loads of regrets and all that like you know imperfections and stuff. i would probably look at me now and be like oh that guy looks like he looks cool man yeah yeah no for sure what about you bro what was my thing yeah 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 I was deep in this the other day, yeah? And I don't know how, I still don't know how to word it, yeah? Mm. But that life, yeah, mm. it's, it's messed. And I'll tell you why. I feel sorry for parents, yeah? 
Mm. And I feel sorry for us because we're going to become parents. Think of it, yeah? You grow up. Where's this guy? Wait, listen. I, I don't know. It's just family dynamics is a weird thing to me, yeah? Like, imagine us, we've grown up, yeah? Mm -hmm. Like, all we know is our siblings and our parents. That's all we know. That's what we've been brought into the world knowing. Mm. Siblings and parents are a nice little tight knit family, yeah? Yeah. Gee, as soon as you become an adult, and as soon as you start then going and living your own life, and then this person starts going living their own life, and as soon as everyone starts leaving the nest, like eventually you form your own family now. And you only care about, not only care about, but your main focus becomes the family you're going to produce, like your missus or your husband or whoever, and then their children. And that becomes the new family for your kids. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? And then slowly, and then slowly that family gets yeah, broken man. apart. The sisters and the brothers and the mom and the dad, that gets broken apart and then the parents just left alone together. It's bare sad, bruv. I don't know, man. I look at my family mm -hmm. and I just look how everyone's like, kind of like, slowly and like now i'm working like five days a week in the office slowly and fading in it like everyone's just like it's not what i knew as a kid and i don't like it and i feel sorry for my parents but i know that's going to be me one day and it's weird i know yeah yeah, yeah. and, and like exactly my sisters have got exactly their family saying, yeah, yeah. 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 My, my sisters exactly have got their family and like i know my sister's main priority now as it should be is her family is her kids Mm. But that's just the the cycle of life, isn't it? That's it's that's scary cycle though. The cycle of life. Bro, yeah. it's, it's scary. But not a lot of people think it, not, not a lot, lot of people deep it, bro. So they don't deep Sorry. it. Now, do Family dynamics and that. Like it's weird. Like leaving mm. the nest. Like literally it's it's a it's a scary mm. thing, bro. No, I get yeah. you, I get you. I was deep in it the other day, I nearly cried, fam. Like that. What are you saying to me? What was yours? Bro, this I'm gonna divert it to from a deeper one, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need a light heart. No, no, it's a bit too deep. That's not even light heart, bro. This mon monkey pox situation. Oh, we're doing that? I've heard about it, but bro, of first COVID, I believe it's a myth. <laughs> bro, that's what we said I about COVID. Understand. You remember that? And do you know I what? It's a theory. At first, it was like, oh no, two people in the UK, and the next day it was like, oh no, six people in the UK. I'm like, what? It's reached here. It's reached, bro. It started here. Come off it, G. It wasn't founded in the UK. I'm not saying it was founded in the UK. I said that's where I found out. It was. It was. It's like it started here. Where? I don't know where. If it started in London, it hundred percent started in East London. Yeah. Ha do you know why, why would it be East London? Because what do you mean? Why like, wouldn't this is, it be? Like, okay, pause, what, pause, Ilford? Pause, 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 100%. <laughs> this is why Hussein's my guy. We didn't even need to say it, but we thought the same thing. Gee, this is why we do hate monkey pox started in Why do people hate England? East London so much? Bro, why don't they? Uh, gee, I'll be honest with no, you. I've only been to East... No, oh. bro. They, they they mean East London. Google's wrong today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you yeah. know what it is? either Bradford, East London. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Oh, um, Bradford is... <laughs> oh. You you mentioned Bradford a lot on her. You proper hate that uh, place. Nah, you know what? You know I've been Bradford. It's actually calm. Yeah, it's, it's actually calm. Yeah, I've you been know there what? I'll be I'll be real. Once. I've been there. The once. people are actually so kind. Yeah, yeah, bro. I was in the I was in the shop here yeah, and they, they heard our accent a little bit. Oh, you lads from London? Oh, how the fuck yeah. they talk? You know that <laughs> dirty accent. They're like, oh, you lads from London? No, oh. they thought they were like bare cool. One guy, bro. I didn't even ask him. <laughs> starts telling me like his cousins from London. Like, do you know when you go back home? And yeah, they say yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah. My, oh, my my cousin yeah, studied yeah, yeah. in London. Like they're very proud of yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, so he's yeah, like, yeah, yeah my cousin yeah, yeah. studied in London. Well done, man. I'm proud I'm of like, you. in London. Like, Didn't ask, bro. He, start, he starts naming bro. me postcode. Well, like, he told me the postcode. See what his cousin is. The first like couple uh, nah, letters, as if I was gonna know. Wait, wait, one second. As, as, as if I'm gonna go down to his ends and say, oh, I bet your dad. <laughs> yeah. I was like, oh, yeah, I know that area. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me. I, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to let you know your cousin told me. You get me? Was yeah. he uh, Pakistani? I'm no, surprisingly, he wasn't. You know, he was with a Pakistani uh, guy. That makes sense. But he was. Uh, yeah, he was. I'm uh, trying to do something positive for my people, but yeah, every yeah. time they set us. Nah, I'm joking. Yeah. Shout out to my Pakistan. Anyway, shout out, Roman. No, yeah, yeah what monkeypox? What are you saying, <sighs> bro? I'm just saying we just when he thought COVID was over, but I can't like no, no, I can't like. Nah, bro, it's always one thing it, after like, the I've other. But I'm it. tired. I've I'm, I'm, I'm exhausted. It, yeah. I have looked into it. I've done my research. I've done my studies. Yeah, go on. I saw a doctor mm. tweet verified as well. Yeah, it's not some pansy. Ver what does pansy mean actually? It's just like meh. Like, okay, he's yeah, not a pansy. He's a verified doctor. He's got a long surname, so you know he's thirty. He well, the ones you can't pronounce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like Kasafanikos or some yeah, shit. Some <laughs> <What the fuck? laughs> Greek don. He, yeah. <laughs> G. I thought that was a uh, Sri Lankan surname or something. Kasafanikos. Yeah, because they also have no. like martial you know, arts. Oh, Sri Lankan is the, the oldest language in the world. We yeah, have, we like, we like, yo, out that was. Is it actually? According to the comment section. Right. That's why words are bare long because like over time, like yeah, every day is an education. Yeah. <laughs> nah. Yeah. But um, he tweeted. He goes, "Listen, monkeypox is not that deep. I'll tell you why. Number one." And he just listed all the reasons that I forgot. Oh, Maxine. No, no, he did yeah, say that. I don't it's know not, too much about it. Not, no, no, you can't, you can't um, give it as, as easy. It's not as contagious as COVID. Oh, okay. It's not easily transferable. See, like, you have to go research. through retransfer and all that. Like, it's not I just... I say retransfer. Do you get me? It's not, dead. Yeah. It's not as easy as airdrop. I mean, please tell me you got that. COVID is airdrop. 
COVID is airdrop, monkey monkeypox is we transfer. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Do you get it? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it's like. Them ones. I hope yeah. it doesn't turn into uh, another pandemic, bro. That's mad. No, no, it won't. It won't. I doubt it. Speaking of that, I got my. Uh, I'm fully vaccinated now, innit? I'm fully on the. Nah, Round of nah, applause nah, nah, for nah, Hader. This guy. Round of applause. No, no, as in, as in, I'm on, I'm officially on the dark side now. G. Wait, was is this recent? Literally. Well, how day. many vaccines? Well, how how many Two. I swear it's three. Three's. The, I think the third one's with the booster in it. Well, that's how comes? How level. comes? How comes? I've, I don't think that's compulsory. <laughs> <laughs> how how comes? You believe in that? Why? Why? Why is why so late? So, <laughs> bro, when's the flipping deadline? No, nah, it's true though. Uh, if you're going to do it in the first couple months when it was hype, you have to do it when, <laughs> it was, when the bro, hype yeah, was I there. It's like essentials. You can't buy essentials. No, no, no. If I catch someone on the train wearing a mask right now, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's true. Do you know what I mean? Wait, are you vaccinated? Yeah, yeah. You have to catch the trend. No, I'm triple vaccinated. What's he talking about? When it was the trend. Wait, wait, ask how many vaccines he's got. When it was the trend, I would have done it. I would have. If I was to do it, I would have done it when it was trending. Why? No, no, I don't follow crowds. Wait, are you not vaccinated? No, that's old season, bro. I can't stop clapping for you. Trust me, you man were clapping like I've done it. I the way he was coming out to me, he has all the booster vaccines. Jeez. Have you what? You done the? You, you done three or four? Uh, three. Oh, you're vaccinated. Yeah. Trend. When did you get them done? When? Yeah. When the hype happened. Oh, so you done it when it was trending? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was. Bro, cool. I, I told round you, applause, like, I don't. Yeah, round of applause, but <laughs> I don't follow. Bro. I don't follow hype. I do my thing, bro. Bro, cool. have I do you even had COVID? Says the one wearing Cortez, but yeah, cool. Yeah. Yeah, what's wrong with Cortez? Listen, bro, you were you, no, you're, you're talking about. Mind. I don't follow the hype, but you're wearing Cortez. Gee, let's not do that now. No, wait, 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 wait. Let's are we, are we come doing off this? It, are we doing this? Are we doing this? Let's stop. Are we doing this? I said, so what, bro? Like, bro come but on, you, man. You, you dislike Cortez? No, I like Cortez, but you can't say I don't nah, follow but, trends nah, when nah, you nah. copped Cortez. No, no, I'm not saying, but bro, Cortez isn't a hype though. It's been around for a minute now. I mean, no, 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 no. I, I, I'm not, I'm, of course, it's been around. I'm gonna get attacked for this, but I actually wore Cortez way before it blew. No, 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 bro. I saw the new Instagram page. I was like, "Raw, this looks nice," but it was on private. To be fair, to be fair, I've worn this top like three, three times. You know, round of applause for him, I'm joking. This guy. No, no, as in, as in, come on, bro. Sorry, sorry, sorry. He's tired. He's tired. Sometimes the swag has to be a bit of a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? I noticed though, my my wardrobe. I need, bro. I'm just so boring. Black, white, black, white. Same. Summer's coming. I need, I need nice fits. Trust me. I mean, I got a red hoodie here, but. If you want sweets, by the way, tell me in it. But yeah, man. Oh, man. Um, um, once I lose weight, I'm gonna start wearing like neon green and shit. Swear like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How tight was it? Billie Eilish, the girl with a. Uh, Who's that? Yeah, you know that singer. Isn't it lovely? Sing another verse than me. Nah, love it. Sorry. I heard she's a sick singer though. Billie, Eil- Billie Eilish, Eilish. Eilish, Eilish. Yeah. Let's wrap it up, man. I don't know what you're talking about. Bro, you know her songs, man. Mothers, I don't. Sing for me some more. What's another video? I'm the bad guy. Yeah, you need to stop immediately. I'll be real. Bro, <laughs> I, I, that one, I ain't heard that one. I'm the bad guy. What I is that? Like, I, I swear lovely. that's uh, Undertaker's theme tune, G. <laughs> he, I'm the bad guy. <laughs> Billy Eilish. No. You, now you'll go. Sing. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, okay. Are you vaccinated? No. no? Said, nah, He's a real G. Oh, he is the me. vaccine. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he, he made the vaccine a vaccine. For the vaccine. <laughs> Pfizer needs everything. Wait, did you bro, even get COVID? Cool. Huh? Did yeah, you get yeah, COVID? I, yeah, I got yeah, COVID. Yeah. Have, you, have you ever had COVID? Again, yeah. when it was trending. Bro, I couldn't I couldn't walk. I got it I when couldn't it was walk. This guy, this guy. I could not walk. Gee, if you get COVID in the past he had the six Cortez months, version you're, of COVID, you're, you're, so you're he quit when it was trending. <laughs> Gee, imagine getting COVID after it's after like it's stopped trending, bro. Allow it, wallo. I got it in uh, August last year. So it was still that it was still popping a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. Did I, lockdown did, lockdown did I get was still being debated. Was it cut off date? Lockdown was still being debated. Now, lockdown isn't even a thing anymore. Yeah, so if, if you, you get, get COVID it. now, you're immature. Yeah. 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you get COVID, in grow up. Move on. Now. Monkey pox is on the rise. Trust Jump me, ship. Think of a new thing. Monkey pox is looking at you like, what the? Cat needs us. Monkey pox. I don't think that will turn into anything. But anyway. Just before we carry on. Oh, yeah, go on. Actually, no, no. Forget that for a second. The comment section last week, bro. I was happy. Oh shit, let me do a comment. No, yeah, no, do, yeah. do the do the yeah. skip stuff. Let me do comment of the week. Come, welcome back to the Hate Squared podcast. You amazing, beautiful people. Uh they were they were loving your your news, Hussein, bro. Oh yeah, thank you, you know for all the nice say, messages, man. Mashallah, it was so happy. It was so happy. It was so nice to see. It was nice to see how happy others were for for Hussein and love, love. You know, shout out to the couple comments, mention my name as well, but obviously the highlight was on Band That Big Nooch. Yeah, and, right for um, you. What'd you say? <laughs> I didn't say anything to you. I literally heard you say something. But anyways, yeah, man. Shout out to the comment section. Let's keep up the targets. Um, what are we saying for likes? How many likes are we aiming for for this video? No, I don't do that anymore. No, no, I'll do that. Let's see how We many. do that. We got 177 last one. All right, cool. 200 likes on this video minimum. So if you're watching on YouTube and you want to let us know, smash that like button. And of course, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You know what I'm saying? But as always, 
a massive thank you to obviously we changed it up today left the box in the car got the travel bag we're always talking to you about shout out to the folks over at man like manscaped hussein mm. these ones the bottles are a bit different huh yeah they, they sent me the new thing in it i haven't got the update yet yeah yeah there we go there we go you lot can see that that's a new thing yeah as in i think the branding's new this this still stays the same oh okay but obviously this is the uh and obviously the boxes here i've got everything here in it this is Should the be. The travel bag and all the stuff, the the crop preserver. Yeah, I tried that. It was very good, you know. Yeah. Smells amazing. And the crop reviver, which is essentially like uh, lotions and moisturizers for your yeah for your downstairs department. Mm -hmm. Um, a product that you know we've been endorsing for a little while, and yeah, man, it's just one of them things that at this point, if you if you ain't convinced by now, then you probably just don't like showering or something, because. I don't, I don't know what you're doing with your life. You know them ones. Use hate squared for 20% off with free shipping worldwide. Uh, shout out to Manscaped for always believing in us. And of course, we believe in them. So if you rate us, rate yourself, use the discount. Hussein, use what for how much off? Use uh, hate squared for 20% off plus free <laughs> shipping yeah. worldwide. Yeah, I was, uh, I was just deep in this oh, comment. You, you in the comments, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Hate squared 20% off, free shipping worldwide. It can be anywhere in the world, anywhere around the globe. Trust and you can get me. it for free. Um, well, yo, shipping. is uh, if I'm not mistaken, is Father's Day in June? Yeah, it is. is yeah? It? yeah, I'm not sure what. See, day. that's the thing. Mother's Day is the one that's no, no, really because obviously Americans have different. Yeah, yeah like, they do everything backwards. You know, what I'm trying to say. So the email I got, I wasn't sure. Oh, oh, oh. but basically, if I'm not mistaken, Father's Day is in June. Look after your fathers. Yeah, look after your father. But then some people, eh, but it's weird. nah, bro. It's not weird. You're nah, that's not weird. You're thinking. <laughs> you're thinking about your father. <laughs> yeah, you. You're thinking, I mean, if you really care about your dad, then you'd get him that, but that's just none of my business, personally. Yeah. You get me? Or just get it for yourself. Yeah, even if you don't want to use even it. Even if you're not a pops. Trust me. Fuck it. Get it for yourself if you do want to be a pops. Trust me. Oh, yeah, but literally. Promoted, if you do want to be a father one day, oh, and you want to like be, in, you want to like have that. Yeah. that that makes yeah. children, you need to look after your, <laughs> your that area, course, man. I'll be real with you. I may have came through with the Yeah, I may have the you, Yeah, man, skip. Where you at? All right. <laughs> Must I, wait, all right. <laughs> Listen, are we doing comment of the week here? Yeah, yeah let's do it. What, let's what, do it, let's what, do what do comments are you reading from what? You last, should, all right, so should last episode, for, the, for those of you that don't know, yeah, last episode, yeah. I said, because Poet and Vuj used to do this thing called comment of the week. Oh, okay. So I said, like, you know what? Let's do a comment of the week. Let's get someone, whoever it is, you guys go into the comment section, type a comment, whether it's something that you like about the episode. Um, something that stood out about the episode something that stood, stands out about the podcast question, whatever it is it could yeah. literally it could be a question it could be a comment it could be a fact it could be anything comment of the week we'll pick one comment and we'll read it every week mm -hmm. if you're on spotify or apple podcasts you're mm -hmm. listening to this of course. leave a review and we'll do review of the week Real shit. there's no rules Real shit. so comment like of the that. week this week <clears throat> let's do it i'm gonna give it to mystical shout out to you my guy hold tight mystical so he says this yeah First, he's a businessman making 20p for fart bombs. <laughs> and now he's a manager of a gaming company. I'm not going to lie. Right now, you're actually doing what I want to do. I love the gaming industry. And I saw you like me. I can relate to you. And also, same upbringing in a way. I'm only 13, but I'll be so real. Well done. I think that's what I'd be. I'd be so real. It's mm. Whatever. Um, well done for this. And being someone I look up to in a way and I've only known you for the past two months love the podcast and of course the emoji the clapping emoji thank you Mr. Cool my guy Mr. Cool shout, shout out, out to Mr. you cool. first ever comment that's of the a week. very cute comment you very know what I'm cute, saying bro. and it's good that you know what you want to do at the age of 13 there's mm. no reason why you can't be where I'm where I currently am mm. or even higher yeah. at a literally, younger age literally. at the same age as me whatever it is you know what you want to do go and achieve mm -hmm. it my boy and uh, yeah man and do your it's thing. so you know what's the most amazing thing about this bro like Imagine we had something like this when we were 13. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine how many questions, yeah, queries true. and concerns, like speaking about grooming, speaking about puberty, yeah. speaking about girls, relationship, yeah. uh, flipping uni, whatever, all the stuff we've spoken about in the mm -hmm. past two and a bit years. Mm. A 13 year old watching it, it's the power of the internet, man. It's true. I feel, I feel like we're living in a time where so many people avoid, uh, they, oh, my screen time's high, mm. I'm addicted to my phone. And it's, there's always like this negative connotation on, yeah. on like, the internet and phones and technology but the truth is bro the, the reality is times have moved forward mm. and so many benefits have come from the internet and one of them is like a 13 year old kid is seeing that from a 25 year old you know adult yeah that's a great role model mashallah Sim he said you, you, similar background right similar upbringing apparently yeah similar upbringing he's probably maybe asian uh, arab or whatever it is mm. So yeah, man, shout out to you, him shout and shout out to, to you. Like, big yourselves up, him. man. Like, you actually got 13 year olds looking up to you lot. Oh, yeah, That's mad. Do you know what it is as well? Like, I think they forget that. Alhamdulillah, man. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, man. We're, we're not gone. 
yeah, 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 yeah we're not yeah, gone yeah. so like i'd like to think that there is still that interaction between mm. us and them mm. and you get me like you can slide into our dms you can chat to us like you can email us if you need anything like there's sweet. like we're genuinely here to support you as yeah, much yeah, as you're yeah, here literally. to support us literally i think the best thing i was gonna say not the best thing but like sometimes and and i'm not necessarily saying this is a bad thing because imagine being someone with like 60 70 000 followers subscribers of course your dms are going to get flooded your mm -hmm. emails are going to be constantly on a daily basis like just just crazy in it but i think one thing that we as hate squared pride ourselves on is like we ensure that we're that we're reachable yeah. in a sense of like obviously if someone says something stupid or like a dm that's just cringe or like someone's asking a silly question of course mm -hmm. not everyone's gonna get our attention but mm -hmm. like for the most part i like to think that we're we're not you know those creators bro like you're like oh i could never, never have a conversation yeah, yeah. with them or like yeah. they'd never reply to a comment yeah, yeah, or they'd yeah. never reply to a dm or they'd never reshare my story yeah. but like i'm not saying we do a favor to anyone but do you see my point yeah, like, yeah. like i like to think we're very hands-on with our community like yeah. i don't like to use the word fan base because i genuinely think we've got like a community yeah, of yeah, like yeah. followers you Support, know what i'm trying yeah. to say big up to them man. um I yeah obviously shout out amir for coming and yeah yeah big up amir for anytime, coming bro. second time now yeah anytime bro you might be hate no, H cubed. It doesn't make sense. Change, yeah, change your right. name to something that begins with H, and we call it H yeah. cubed whenever you're here. I'll figure something out. But as you're Hassan. here, because I do wanna, I wanna <laughs> share something, uh, which is you know bouncing off what you said. Mm. Uh, you're the guest today, bro. Yeah. What uh, emoji should the people leave in the comment section today? What emoji? Keep yeah. it PG, man. Keep it. Yeah. I know how you keep, get. Keep it PG, but nothing. Do you know what's basic. my favorite emoji? Not on the first page. Something a bit. Yeah. A bit that okay. No, no, no. Go on. What, was, what were you gonna say? What were you gonna say? You know, you know the smiley face, but it's upside down. Now nah, we've yeah. had that before. Have we? Yeah, yeah. Change it up, man. In a bit Go where on. the people have to scroll through the keyboard, type it in on the search, you know what I'm saying? A fruit, ah, can, wait, can I search on my phone? Quick, 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 yeah, yeah make it snappy, dog. Trust uh, me. Like, let's make it no, snappy. No, do you know why? Because I've got I've got some cute news, it's yeah. not even it's not, no, it's not, it's nothing big, it's nothing big, it's just something like, yeah, let me just, you haven't told me. No, but it's not even like that. Uh, like, it's I've told you this loads of times. Well, you got your own emoji coming through, <laughs> yeah, soon come. Imagine that if you could make an emoji, what would it be? It'd be... Oh, that's a hard question, you know. It'd be like a normal emoji, like like someone smiling or whatever, but mm. like rather than, um, you know, like fresh air coming out your mouth, mm. it'd be like the fresh air bubble with like a, with a, a fire in it because I'm always saying lit, lit. So lit like that. Do you know what? Yeah, a Apple. shopping cart. Apple, if you're watching. Don't ever do that. Never do that. Drop a shopping cart. Don't ev A shopping cart? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, we just started, bro. Should we start the episode again? Yeah, start again, G. Yeah, welcome back. What's What do you mean? What do you mean? Shopping cart? Is this well, Amazon? You said anything a bit more like right, past the smiley right, Give us some right, history. Give me the reason. Like, like why? Well, you just saw it and it looks nice. Uh, say no more. Shopping cart. Do you know what? Yeah, do you know what I mean? It's bare random. Ah, uh, cool, cool, cool. Fair okay, enough. Then. Well, I mean, like, what, what emojis have you not had? No, 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 no. That's cool. No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. Oh wait, 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 wait. Nothing wrong with it. He's money motivated. That's why. All he sees is all he sees is fears. Hala, shopping cart. Oh, man. Drop a shopping cart for no reason at all, but just do it for Amir. Fuck it. <laughs> oh, he looks disgusted. <laughs> yeah. He's just confused. But anyways. Anyway, I was saying, uh <laughs> Do you have a nice little uh Yeah, it's not even a Oh yeah, go on, go on, go on, actually. Yeah. We better say something. No, 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 go on, go on. Um, no, nah, it's not even like a story or anything. It's, I was at um so a few I was at the cinema yesterday. Oh yeah. Uh <laughs> This I know, I know what this is, bro. No, 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 no I'm not talking about no, that. No, 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 no. Let's relax. Let's relax. No, 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 it's not. Yeah, we're not gonna get into. We don't. We don't do that here. We don't do that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's not do that. I'll tell you off camera. Our DMs have been flooded about that, by the way. Yeah. And after the film finished, um, you know, oh, are you from Hate Squared? Yeah. Like people, like it's very cute, man. And I was at a wedding as well on the weekend, and again, people showing love. Is do you know that feeling of like? seeing the supporters in real life yeah yeah, yeah. it's actually it's yo nice. guys like say what well, go on in it like it's a nice feeling yeah. like like we Someone appreciate said hello it. to me today i swear yeah he was walking his dog he goes you're the guy from podcast and i was like yeah Jeez. he goes yeah man i watch your stuff i was like love bro try, and when he try. walked off just had to double check quickly like was he really on but he was a cool guy now i'm joking shout <laughs> out to you my boy yeah now nah, that was it really it was just yeah, like yeah. you know being recognized for your work it's a very it's cute humbling feeling so so thank you to the supporters Obviously, shout out to the monarchy as well because we got a nice little weekend. Oh, yeah, hold time. I watched nothing. Yeah, yeah, neither did I. Oh, hey, Queen's on YouTube now. Swear. Yeah, she done, uh, she done, what's, are you lots involved as well? Where are you That Wall of Comedy, are, are they doing the uh, Wall of Production? Definitely not. No? Nah? Definitely not. Not on Foot Asylum? 
No, no, no. The no, Queen's on YouTube. Queen's on YouTube. G. What's she, she done, doing? She done, next lap challenge. She done, <laughs> <laughs> she done. She done a video with uh, Paddington. You know the bear. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I haven't right. seen the video, but I saw the thumbnails. I ain't clicking. Like, Paddington's on. Paddington's on. It's queen. on trending page. First video, and she's on pa- trending page. Queen. Imagine the Queen saying, "Be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe." Imagine the Queen doing a uh, re- reacting to my Reddit. Or ASMR. Oh, I'm dead. oh, imagine her doing a mukbang eating a burger. I think Queen would do, would do good yeah. ASMR, you know. Imagine that must be grim. What's that? What Queen mukbang? Peeked in my mouth a little bit. That's what disgusting. Queen doing? The, the Queen doing ASMR. What about Queen? <laughs> Queen? That's disgusting. That's a bit rude. Queen uh, crossbar challenge. <laughs> <laughs> I joined the Jeff Watch. What's this? What's that guy's name again? That's a top bins. Like SPF Russia. <laughs> oh yeah. Wait, yeah, wait, yeah. What did you say? What did you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eric knows him apparently. I SPF Russia. If the Queen ever did that, yeah. I don't even know what no, that is. Jim, Jim. He's actually American. He is American. He's American. Really? Yeah, he's American. He Do you know what? I found that wow. out last week. He's actually American. He's only putting on the accent. FPS Russia. Yeah. Is American. American and he's only putting the accent. What is that? Is, is, it, is it a YouTuber? Yeah, oh, I don't know who he is. You can't believe everything. Yeah. Or imagine the Queen doing like. Uh, yeah. He he does like gun reviews. Yeah. More Russian than my accent, and I have no accent. He does like gun reviews. Russian, right? Accents. Well, imagine doing like um, what's it called, Mr. Beast content. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. Who, Mr. Bean? Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Or I subscribed. Uh, or I paid um, five graphic designers on Fiverr to make my blah blah. <laughs> yeah, this is how it went. And you just see the queen in the thumbnail. Uh, <laughs> That's mad. His name is Kyle Lamar. Ah. Oh. Well, imagine the queen in a Stratford baiting skets up. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> That would be hilarious. <laughs> Imagine that. Yeah. Alhamdulillah, keep it halal. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, keep it halal. Fucking hell. Hey, what gives you the ick? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the que- Imagine the queen asking what your ick is. Hey, oh queen, my man. god. Imagine explaining to the queen, uh, yo, your, ma- your majesty, queen. this is what an ick is. Imagine being the queen. I, I was going to ask though, what's your lot's opinion on the uh, the monarchy, the royal family, and that? Are you up? Are you up? Opposed to it? Are you positive towards it? Are you gonna? You know what? It's neutral. Like, Bro, I, 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 just, I, I don't genuinely care. don't care. Yeah. It's like you know the, the jubilee. I just, I just don't care. Yeah, it's true. Well, like, just, I just, like, I don't, don't care. Yeah, yeah it doesn't. It like, don't. I don't even bat an eyelid. To That's it. Like, what, I don't, yeah, I, yeah. Like I've never. Like I don't. I don't even know what her bro, surname is. Bro, there are what's actually people going to this Elizabeth parade and actually bro. celebrating. Should it? I find out? What what's the What's the queen's surname? Imagine her first name's Queen. No, no, no. And surname Elizabeth. Queen's full Bro, name. Bro, people, like thousands of people actually went to Buckingham Palace. Uh, and you ready, yeah? Go on. Her surname is mad. I swear they're, they're German. Well, have a guess. Would you, no, no, it's, it's, no it's, a, it's a... It's an English one. What does it start with? All right, it's a, it's a location in the UK. Huh? It's a, it's a, it's a name of a place. Bradford. <laughs> <laughs> Elizabeth Bradford. <laughs> nah? Amir, this is what your last needed. Did you hear what he just said? G, what's her surname, G? Bro, I said, guess the Queen's surname. It's a location in the UK. Man said Elizabeth Bradford. No, what's her, what's her, what's her surname? Elizabeth. G, he's out of it. What's her, well, yeah, that is a place in the UK. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. he didn't get but, it. Yeah. It was actually funny. Go on. Her Wait, name what is, does it start with? Uh, w. Windsor. Yeah. Her name, Elizabeth Alexandra Mary Windsor. No way. She's named after Slough, bro. No, but she, they're from there, I swear. Bro. Wait one second. You're yeah, telling is, me. Is you're telling me the Queen's surname is Windsor, as in the place next to Slough. That is the. That's the worst representation of the Queen. Big that, the queen. If, if uh, obviously the castle's nah, she's there, give, isn't she's it? given up the like, she's she's come on man, paying homage to the minority ethnics and that. He, brother, that's a howler though. Bro, if, <laughs> if you imagine your Windsor, surname you know. being s- the place next to Slough. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's a bit of an L. But it's better than being that. the place next to. Uh, yeah. <laughs> who's your who's your favorite? Who's your favorite out of the no no band? favorite? If I was to choose, it'd yeah. be my man, Fingy, uh, Diana's son, Harry. Um, Wait, they got she's got two. Harry and who? William. 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 If I had to pick, Meghan Markle. Nah, but she doesn't. No, no, no. She, yeah, yeah. She, she's no, no, okay, wait, wait, she's wait, wait, from wait. outside. Wait, dead or the, alive? Because if it was dead as well, then, then obviously Princess Diana. Diana, Diana. Diana yeah. is the every ethnic mum's. She's she's there. Why is that? Every ethnic human. Not even mums. Human loves Diana. I don't think I've met a single person apart from the op block. Do you know why? Think they love her. Do you know why? Do you know why? She did go out with, was it an Arab guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why. Do you think so? She just, 100%. Got, she just started that trend. Was it that guy's dad owned Harrods at the point? Or yeah, something yeah, like yeah. that? Yeah, yeah, yeah I think he, was, he owned Fulham as well, right? Fulham Football Club yeah, yeah, later yeah, yeah. on. Oh, I didn't so know that. peak. Yeah. 100% they killed her. They yeah, killed them both off. Yeah, she's my favourite as well. Yeah. Didn't really know her too tough. But, um... 
Yeah, man. Yeah, I'll, if, if, I, if, if I was to choose apart from her, it'd be Harry. Yeah, Harry's cool. I like what he'd done as well. I like the man that like break the rules a little bit. That are like yeah, 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 a bit yeah. rebellious. Bare people don't rate him for what he done though. Thirty. The whole Meghan Markle thing. Nah, I, I don't, bro. I, like I said, I don't. I couldn't care in it. My least favorite though is the nonce. Is it Charles. What? No, one of them's a nonce, isn't it? Charles is probably a nonce. I think Charles is the nonce. Charles yeah. is the one who used to chill with Jimmy Savile. I think. No, no, no. And that William? Andrew's the nonce. Andrew's the nonce. Who's Andrew now? The, the big remember? don The big don. Nah, nah, I don't know him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's the Queen's other son. Charles' brother, I think. Charles, yeah. Charles' brother. His face. Uh, I think, I think, I think. Charles's face yeah. looks like the Champions League trophy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi Bro, that was... How can your face look like that? Man said the Champions League trophy. I've seen his ears. He's Man the one with the ears, isn't it? <laughs> Man said the Champions. It's crazy out here. I'm man. gone. Is he the one with the ears? Bro, they all got ears, as in the, the pointy ones. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's him, isn't it? Yeah. Gee. Donnie's always got top button done up. His face looked like yeah. he was in Paris a couple of days ago. I thought you were going to say a raisin. That would no, have been no, funny no. as well. But man said the Champions League trophy. trophy, you know. Big can up. you explain the. Bro, I just want to know what goes on inside that palace. Yeah. On a day to day, like imagine Big Brother. Bro, but they, they bro. definitely play hide and seek. They definitely play hide and seek. Big Brother in there. Bro, oh. it's not normal for a yard to be that. How can you live in that yard? Day six in Buckingham Palace. <laughs> <laughs> the Queen has just gone for her first shit of the week. Imagine that. <laughs> that needs to be done still. Might have, might have to drop an inquiry. Yeah. Might make a deck and send it to Buckingham Palace. Man said make a deck. <laughs> this guy is... <laughs> Man said I use Canva and shared the link. Man used Canva to send it to the Queen. That's I'll tell you the benefits. TikTok content that could be made. She's on YouTube now, bro. She could be... This is 100%. This she's going to be the, start be the, of her be the renegade and all that stuff. This could be the Trust start of her me. influencer career. 100%. I wouldn't Queen, be surprised. Gee, at Queen. Yeah. At Lizzie. Mm, big Liz. That's that big that's, Liz. That's the one right there. She's if got that what, handles taken. Gee, she's got about four years max. Let's be honest. You reckon? She needs to change. I it can't up. lie, bro. She, she needs to change it up. She needs then to do something different in her life. She needs, and she's always. You know what I'm saying? Like when you got that much money, you're gonna do what? What's with the faces? Oh my eyes. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna say you done that a few times. Gonna say oh, you're sorry, right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, no, no, no. It's cool. I'm just saying if you're right. Yeah, yeah. I'm um, fine. she's got so much peas, but her swag's always the same. Yeah, she she don't dress herself. Clearly. Yeah. Whoever her stylist is needs to be changed, bro, because, you know what I'm saying? We've got Palm Gee, Angels every now and Cortez, then. Isn't it? A bit like, of Cortez, That's what I'm saying. <laughs> You're watching all the trends go by, Trust but me. you're dressing how you used to dress the 90 queen years ago. Has right, but do you know what? Do you know what? You know how she's wearing her Range Rover on her ones? One arm. Huh? Have you seen yeah, yeah I thought that was fake. She know? drives. Yeah, 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 bro, I she thought, drives a range bro, on her ones from one arm. Oh, yeah, I thought that was fake. She's actually working it. tell me the queen has done driving lessons. Oh, no, 100%. Yeah, bro, I've seen videos of her driving. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Whoever Queen. was the instructor was actually threatened by her family. What's her playlist like, do you think? Gigs? Bro, she probably got Beethoven. Beethoven? No, 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 no. Beethoven. I say gigs. I say gigs. Beethoven. I say Beethoven. gigs. I say gigs. She's got gigs. She's definitely got Skepta Ace with Flow on that. Whipping the hardest. <laughs> whipping and that. Trust me. Whipping excursion. She's got to be done. She's got a bit of Santana. She's got rat, a bit of rattling as well. You reckon when she time. hears uh, Fredo stay free at <laughs> Lizzie? She goes, BAP! <laughs> <laughs> she puts on the gun fingers. She's like, Turn, wheel this up. Bro, I heard she's the reason N dubs are back. She put the reunion back. Alright, the queen's getting a bit too much attention. No, no, man. freaking. I didn't find oh, it's not oh, she just had a weekend, man. Yeah. She's like, literally, you know, bro. This weekend made me realise yeah. people love her, bro. Yeah, yeah. You see that video? Oh, I wouldn't mind paying tw- tax twice, double tax for her. Who said that? Some some white woman, bro. What? A no- bro, they actually went. Wa- I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna use the term wasted, bro. They actually spent their weekend going to Buckingham Palace and waving their flags. No, bro, bro. They genuinely bro, love the. Bro, I know. But, but I know. Again, bro, but it's, it's not. Like, I it's don't. Like, I don't example, see it, man. No, nah, that can't be real. No, but it's like for example, like they need to be paid The same way Pakistanis feel about, for example, Imran Khan. They love the guy. Or the founder of Pakistan, um, Muhammad uh, Ali Jinnah, I think his name was. Is he still He's around? What, the founder? Yeah. Or Imran Khan? No, no, founder. Oh, bro, he got, yeah, he got, I think, got assassinated like a year after Oof. Pakistan w- became independent or something. Like that? Big word, he, you he, know? I, thi- I think he got assassinated, or, but he, nah, he he died like a year or two after Pakistan became independent. Big up, my man. Yeah. But obviously, maybe we say this because we're not English mm-hmm. and we don't have that. He's got his own hat, innit? The, yeah, the classic. Oh, you yeah. know about that? Yeah, yeah, man. yeah, 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 yeah. What? I'm impressed you know that Him uh, and New Era Collaboration Trust maybe. me bro He's the reason Snapbacks th- It used to be that Oh okay It used to be that yeah Fair enough But anyways uh, How old that da- Dappy's uh, Willie Did you yeah, ever have yeah, one yeah. of them? Yeah I never owned one yeah. Nah I didn't own one But there was a trend going around yeah Don't know if you lot had this But it was a black glove Yeah And then on top was another layer But oh, the, f- yeah, the fingers yeah, yeah. were cut off 
yeah, like yeah, it was yeah, cut yeah. off until like the middle of your finger. Yeah, seven and days, was, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was yeah, seven patterned. days. Like, yeah, it was like, yeah. um, it was uh, pink, black, yeah. pink, black, or like orange, black, orange, black. I remember seeing that around, but I don't think. It well, the black doves used to get from Church Street really Market. A, yeah, no, but I copped it from Harrow on the Hill. I'll never forget. In my ends, it wasn't really a, a trend. You like this? You take pictures like this. You remember when people used to comment, "I own this pick." Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's NFTs. All right, I thought you had something there, bro. I, I that's basically oh, yeah, an yo, NFT. Listen. You, you see JME's been, what he's been oh saying about NFTs. Oh my days. What's that? What's that? Back in the day, they were literally on, N bro, that's an NFT. Imagine someone commenting, I own this pick. That's it, it's theirs. It's their picture. Poverty. Imagine someone said to you 10 years down the line that yeah. you you can actually own a pick. Bro, we were we were trendsetters. Yeah. Wow. Actually, do, do you remember that pose? This one here. Yeah, that was the one. One other. The one other. Show. One. You remember Show. the one when you're holding a box? That doesn't exist. <laughs> That. <laughs> that was definitely your school. I was. No one else did that. Oh, bro. but the one on the phone as well. I hate this one. This he one. still does that, G. Sometimes. sometimes. <laughs> no, I don't, I wait, wait, don't wait, like it. To my ear? Yeah. Fuck off, do I do it to my ear? You don't do it to your ear? No, 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 no. no you no. do FaceTime, innit? You do oh, that. Oh, no, 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 no. Piss off. The pretend to be on the full phone. Shit. The pretend to be on the phone. Do I do that at 26 year old? Do I do that at this big age? That's half hearted. Wait, bro, do it. If you're going to do it, do it properly. That's half hearted. I'm not going to. Sometimes. Maybe a little, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? No. No? Nah. Uh, Mum is already cooked. Oh. You know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> I thought, this I thought guy, bro. Trying to insult me, bro. You don't do these ones either, no? Nah, nah, I don't you really do selfies. Take a picture I don't really do oh. selfies. If I do a selfie, it'll be a selfie video. Why is the, but why is the phone on a look? How, why is that a look? It just, it just shows that you got one. No, I'm busy right now. Because back in the yeah. day, it was like, raw. if you got a phone, you're kind of safe still. Yeah. So maybe yeah. back then, but now it's like, bro. bro Sony every... Ericsson Walkman. That's what I had. Gee, that was nice. Yeah, but bro, back in 07. Well, back in the bus playing T2 Heartbroken. Oh. Gee, I had the E. <laughs> <laughs> I had a, <laughs> I had a Nokia. That song slapped. And that was on. Back in the bus, Trust everybody used to bag out shoes. Uh. <laughs> oh, do you remember when Jay Sean dropped the Stay remix with Boy Better Know? Please tell me you remember that. Bro, I didn't listen to music growing up, you know. Bro, please tell me you remember the, And if I the, did, it was all the like... The Boy Better Know Stay remix. It was UK stuff. Is that the one with Skepta in it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah all yeah. of them. Oh, that was a funny remix. Because he's saying, No, 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 no. I can't take no more of this. And then them man are spitting bars saying... Saying, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you leave her, leave her, go. If you leave her, no. You <laughs> yeah, don't need yeah, her. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, bro? That was a fucking this. hilarious remix. I remember that, yeah. I used to listen to US stuff a lot. But anyways... That's me. What are you lot saying, man? <laughs> How's life? Oh, actually... How's this year been so far? Because we're six months in now. That's mad. I don't know, bro. I don't I, I don't like mad. these questions. I used to be that guy that used to think of that stuff. Now, six months, you know, straight like that. I don't I know, bro, years. man. Like, I think I'm 26 this month. Do you know how mad this is? Oh, yeah. actually, I'm 26 this month. What date? 20th of June. Aha. Uh -huh. oh. Okay, I'm, what are you doing for your birthday? I haven't got anything planned. Yet. Say no more. Let's do something. Yeah. Come on the podcast and that. Come, yeah, yeah. Come, um, come. Fuck that. I don't know, man. The thing. <laughs> Ring Baklava China. <laughs> What's on the floor? Man, the said, <laughs> what'd you do for your birthday? I appeared on a podcast. That's wet, G. Come on, man. <laughs> on, my, on my birthday, I wouldn't do my own podcast. What are you talking about? <laughs> I invite the man to my birthday. On my birthday. <laughs> As, uh, no, no, neither yeah. of us have filmed. Actually, no, 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 no. My 20 Noah days. Was I, that on your actual birthday? Yeah, yeah. I filmed on my actual birthday. That's wet. No, it's not wet, bro. It's committed, G. That's wet. You're wet. That's I would have pulled out. Anyways. Pull that game strong. Yeah, but go on. Um, um, six what? months into the... To the, to well, the how year. am I feeling? How are you feeling about the year so far, man? Well, you know what? We're at half time now. Okay, keeping it keeping it real. Mm. I'm content. So, grateful for everything. Mm. But I'm not really happy with... Yeah. Like, I'm not really, like, satisfied with mm. things. Obviously, you know... The year started off strong, announced the BBC thing, H squared hit 10k. So it's still a couple of things cooking. Started prepping for my show now, alhamdulillah. Mm. But yeah, just. So you're saying it's not, been downhill since then? It, no, it's not been downhill. It's just there's been no crazy ups, there's been no crazy downs. Mm. It's kind of just been a bit like vanilla. Switzerland. Basically, whatever that means. But Neutral. yeah, I'll give you that. What about you? How's it been? Actually, no, for you, it's been a pretty. For me, it's been. Especially, right. especially Sick recently. For you, though. Yeah, yeah. Is this wood? Yeah, 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 yeah. Touch, touch, touch wood, man. Touch wood right now. <laughs> if you are, you are touch wood, but not your own. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Don't be doing it to this, bro. You missed it. I said touch wood, but oh. you missed it. <laughs> yeah, imagine, imagine the guys <laughs> These one liners right. are actually Trust mad. Trust me. <laughs> imagine, G. How many Red Bulls you had today? Me? Yeah. Had one monster. Mad thing. Yeah, man. Red Bull's a bit too hardcore for me, you know? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. I thought Monster's actually hardcore. Nah, Monster's a bit. So like, Red Bull, 
Like it's made. I only get the non-sugar one. Crackheads. Mm. I think. I get the Red Bull is made for crackheads and smokers. Monster's a bit like if you if you're active, you do a bit of gym, you do a bit of calisthenics, and maybe monster. But anyway, my year so far, uh, can't lie, alhamdulillah, it's been really good. But I'm uh, but I'm hungry, man. <laughs> I still want more. Mm. I still want more, man. Like I'm just excited. But at the same time, it's a weird feeling, yeah, because I'm like, nah, I'm not even gonna say it. But say it, say it. I don't know, man. Like you know when just everything like nah, nah, nah. Let me not, let me not talk okay. about it too much. I'm happy. I'm happy with it. I'm happy with like the year so far. Again, there there is there is room for improvement. There has been struggles here and there, obviously mm. in personal life that happens. But um, yeah, man. To be fair, career career is just one aspect mm. of everything. Like in terms of my fitness, it hasn't been good. In terms of my personal life, it's been 50-50. In terms of my whatever life, it's, you, get, you get me, but I'm looking at it just career. Career has been good, but everything else has kind of been 50-50 to be honest with you, bro. So mm. yeah, what about you, man? I'm overwhelmed, man. Really? I'm overwhelmed. In what sense? Positivity or I didn't realise I'm not I'm not huge in it My following isn't big Yeah I didn't realise It was gonna pop off like this Jeez Jeez I, I did not know What on TikTok Specifically TikTok or? Just YouTube Like the awareness Has been mad Bro I'm Sweet, on H Square twice Oh come <laughs> on man Low it You're my guy Hey the low it you, you're, act, you're acting as if We get fucking like no, 50k no, but views bro Come on come Gee on. I couldn't sleep Knowing you were coming on tomorrow Trust me bro <laughs> What are you talking about Why do you think I've been so stressed out and came See that's how humble I am I'm humble You see what I mean if the, Bro the littlest things Isn't it Yeah I hear that Bro I get, bro, I get overwhelmed Nah it's good though it's good, trust me. No, I don't, I, bro. I'm, I'm so even the l- smallest thing. Oh, even then, mm-hmm. I'm like that as well. Even till now, bro. Like if something will happen, like best one. Like, I don't bro, ask I for much, believe, man. Like, I don't ask for much. Yeah, yeah. Neither, 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 I, I'll be real. I don't think we do either. Like I, I've, I've always told her, like if we get to a point where we've got a decent fan base or a follower base, whatever. Yeah. We're getting decent views on a regular basis. We're getting interaction, whatever. Like, gee, I don't want to be number. One, like I don't have to. Sorry. Yeah. Be number one podcast in the world. I don't have to be number one. Yeah. Podcast yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what? You know what? This concept of always trying to be the first place winner and stuff. Yeah. Bro, you, you just suck out all the joy of everything. If, yeah, if, yeah. If, if every element of your life is, you know, um, what are those cringy phrases and sayings, man? Um, I didn't come here to take part. I came here to take dominate off. and yeah. all that. Take, All right, man. Shout out Conor McGregor. Take over then, bro. But yeah, uh, no, for Conor McGregor to say that, that's different because he's... He came into the UFC and said, I'm not here to take part. I'm here to take over. And everyone woke up. Yeah, but he Everyone but he done up. his thing. Obviously, he's a fighter. He makes money. Yeah, like, well, that, that, that's mental warfare as well. Yeah, don't like, get yo, who's this guy? Me I saying it to Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan's gonna be like, the journey Trust matters me. more than the end goal. That's oh, nah, that's that's I find that cringe as well. No, Sorry, bro, bro. No, no, bro, bro, no. I don't like that. Bro, man. Bail, no, it no, out, no. bail it out, bail it out, bail it out. What was your point? The the journey matters more than the end goal. The journey matters. I'll more explain. Than I'll the end explain. Goal. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm, 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 I'm that, not gonna mention names. When I had one guy on my podcast, he said to me, "Who said that?" Sorry. One guy, he said. One, it's one guy on my oh, podcast. One guy, one guy, sorry, sorry. He said, me being on your podcast, like, what, what's it going to do for me in it? And I was like, he's like, what is your angle? I didn't know how to answer it. But then recently I had someone on. He goes, I mean, so what is the angle? I was like, I came up with the answer. I was like, I, I can't. I don't know what the angle is. Mm. And he started clapping for me. He's like, it's actually, actually about the journey. Mm. Bro, don't think about the angle. Just keep going. I like that, you know. Do you know I what I'm like saying? No, no, don't think about as the it angle. comes. Yeah, fuck no, 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 no. it. Bro, the That's journey, the experience is what matters. I swear to God. Tell him a stick on him. All right, let me. Let, I don't want to interrupt him, innit? I'm a joking, man. <laughs> right, bro, let me put my nose in my mouth. Sure, sure. Nah, um... <laughs> it's all mine. Nah, I hear you. I agree. <laughs> Same thing about patience and journey and that. But I feel like, obviously, there needs to be some sort of milestones, objectives. There needs to be... Yeah, don't... Okay, everything can balance. Don't yeah, be like, if you're... It. Like, for example, this, this, uh, this other thing, oh, consistency is the key to success. Bro, if you've been consistently shit at something and you're just denying it to yourself and you're not seeing no progress this is the harsh reality that people don't like you know for example um what's the other one? Oh, um work ethic hard work will, uh, hard work and consistency will get you places mm. unfortunately that's just not the truth that's mm. just not the truth hard work and consistency can get you places yeah but hard work and, it, it's and a recipe. consistency isn't a recipe that's always gonna give you success in but my this opinion. is hard work bro this episode here might no 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 no, no 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 you're, you're right saying? you're right yeah, and yeah, when yeah. you say journey like for example I I I haven't done it, but if I was to look at any, literally any episode from our first year of Hate Squid, maybe not any, like the last, like when Tom came in and we started yeah, yeah, doing yeah. like Pirate, then Tom. those were okay. Big up Tom, missed that guy. Bro, our, our, our uh, old content, Eric, oh, I cringe, bro. I yeah, can't, is I can't look but, back, but, bro. But let's I be honest. I can't look back. Let's be honest. Even if you watch it now, there is some, it's like an unpolished, 
uh, Jewel. Oh, we, <coughs> bro, who we are as like, as podcasters today. Yeah. Uh, wait, can we call ourselves that? Yeah. Because I don't you're, ever, ever want to claim it yeah. something too soon, innit? Nah, you know what I'm trying to say? Well, gee, if I can make five podcasts on my podcast, I'll fuck off. <laughs> okay, I don't agree with that, but yeah, you know yeah, what I'm trying yeah. to say. Yeah, yeah. I mean, two and a half years, so gee, yeah. Come on, man. Like, I just feel as if, like, I don't know, bro, like, certain things, uh, the journey's important as well, but I also feel as if, like, if your journey is constantly you not improving or not getting somewhere, then maybe I'm just a bit harsh with it or whatever. But yeah, you, I, I don't disagree with I you. I think there's I in, in, you, in, in the in, in the you're middle trying to say point. Something else. Yeah, now in the middle point, there is there is I take from you and I take from there's you. like a gray area. In the there's middle a gray area. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Like you, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of shit artists out there that just need to stop what they're doing. Yeah. But yeah, that's a like if you're thing. consistently <gasps> failing. Go on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I just clocked the XO. It's because you love the weekend, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's been there for about that. two years, bro. I just clocked that. You like that one? Um, that's mad. Come on, man. XL to you just saw it now. I just, I just clocked it. Yeah. Do you know? Do you know that's my side. That's Hader side, yeah. So wait, is that everything you love on that side yeah, is yeah. yours, or anything that everything represents him, and vice versa? You didn't clock that. Wow. You never clocked that. Yeah. Deep it now. Whilst we're talking, deep it and tell me if you notice anything. But yeah, anyways. But now, what was I saying? Uh, before he went, <gasps> what was I saying? Sorry, the grey area. Like you agree with the. Yeah, like if you're yeah. consistently, you know, working hard at something, but with all due respect, you're not getting results. Mm. If you've been grinding at music or a business or whatever, I'm not necessarily saying, oh, stop, G, you're a flop, you're a failure, go home, go to sleep or whatever. Change the game plan. Change something. Yeah. Alter something. Yeah. Pivot. Is that the word? Pivot? Yeah. Yeah. Pivot. Yeah. <laughs> you know that one? Yeah, yeah. Where's that from? Where's Pivot. that from? Friends, friends. Friends, friends. Yeah, yeah. I've never heard of Gary V. Yeah, yeah. G. <laughs> Are you on TikTok? That's his idol, bro. <laughs> Fucking content? Well, Fuck your parents. <laughs> Are you like so old right now? <laughs> Man, that's my idol. You, wait, wait, wait. You exaggerate everything. Bro, he's got pictures of him. I I met him once. In say, like I mean, actually, say Wallah, he was on your lock screen at one point. I'm not saying Wallah, but, ah! but Wallah. I'll say Wallah, but I don't need to say Wallah. Wait, wait, wait. You actually met him? Where? Bro, he had a, like, he was in London one time in 2016. And he came central and yeah. Don't wow. act like it was a coincidence, G. You no, planned no, out your bro, journey. I've, I've admitted it. I've admitted it. No, bro, but there's nothing wrong there's with it. There's nothing wrong with it, bro. I'm joking. You this know, I guy. like just bursting your balls. This guy. No, I like doing I can't it, lie. He's 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 given a lot of value yeah? about social media. Sorry. Yeah, He'll get wrapped. So he has one quote because I read all his books and uh, he, I don't remember where exactly, but he said, if you put, I think he said, five years into something and you see no results, yeah. if you, you have to, like you said, change something. Yeah. But you can't expect results in two or five years because you don't you don't have the skills you need to take time to mm. yeah you do for mm. two years yeah your skills improve so then oh yeah, sure, sure. So like you, you can't Hundred. do something for a year yeah realize you're shit and then be okay I give up. No, 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 of course, course, course. Yeah. I'm not yeah, by the way, I wanna put a little yeah, thank you, bro. Thank you. I'm not trying to say like if you've been doing something for six months and you're not a millionaire yet, then give up. Mm. Obviously like like let's say me and you were still doing hate squared, mm. but we still are doing hate squared. But let's say like from day one till now, but we're only still on like a thousand subscribers or something. Yeah, I'll pack clearly, it in. Say again. I'll pack it in. No, but it would have been packed in. Like we would have yeah, had yeah, that yeah. conversation. Like yeah, I was saying, bro, I know we love what we do, yeah. but it's not working, bro. Yeah, we're you not really. That's just relax. But obviously, when we change things, got better studios, yeah. better equipment, invested more money, then got a trim. Th <laughs> cut my hair yeah, um, the results uh, started reflecting in the in the hard work it's true uh, but yo I want to open up about saying which leads on to um, oh. the conversation that we had today yeah? yeah this is you may tell me off not tell me off but you may say oh hey though, I didn't expect that from you on the like in front of the people yeah Bro, like that, but therapy sessions therapy sessions it's, it's one of them ones today it's one Go of them on. weeks but I feel like we're talking about hard work we're talking about um, consistency you're talking about loving the journey man's talking about Gary V. I am so humbled, yeah, and proud of what we've built with Hate Squared. Mm. We've had on some sick guests, like bro. We had on flipping, mashallah, like yeah, yeah we you know, Doctor Say Adamara, like yeah. that's not not many people can say that. That we've had p other great guests on and yeah. stuff, and just impact that we've had. You know, DMs you see all the time. Yeah, people saying yo because of your content, X Y Z. But sometimes, yeah, I feel like. We've been doing this for so long mm. and there's people who maybe in my opinion aren't as us yeah. as us yeah and i feel like i kind of think like why have we not blown as big as yeah. and i'm not necessarily saying in a comparison like 
like oh just because this youtuber has been doing it for two months and they've got but like are we missing something it's just kind of a bit like we've been grinding because because me everyone knows me and Hussein never miss episodes Mm. we're always on it we've only probably ever missed one or two because of covid or like traveling or whatever but even then we always plan around it Mm. and sometimes it's just just a vibe of like not a not a question of wanting to give up because i would i wouldn't want to give up hate square because it's done more good than bad Mm. alhamdulillah but sometimes it's just you know sometimes you get tired you're like oh bro like yeah like i wish this like you know putting in so much effort with something and it's like only on this many views and you're thinking surely this episode should be on this many yeah. downloads and I don't know bro like am I being negative do you get that as well sometimes no, I've had those thoughts bro yeah, it's yeah. Normal. even last episode to be honest I was like oh man like I wanted it to to hit a certain target or whatever it didn't mm, mm. and um, to be honest there's a lot of things I look at as the podcast host along with you and we look at and we're like oh this isn't as good and that's not as we good could have improved. we could we could do that better or or that number needs to go up or conversion whatever it is yeah mm. but the viewer is just watching and they're just enjoying they're just enjoying yeah like, they don't really think yeah. of it too deep bro like they might they might watch an episode and be like you know what like i like this episode i'm definitely going to tune in next time they might watch an episode and be like oh it's not for me in the first five minutes and then maybe miss like four episodes and come back in it you just ne- like you just gotta keep doing what you're doing and hope it catches on and mm, we have true. seen we have seen rapid growth at we've had we've had like what's it spurts spurts, Sp- spurts yeah spurts yeah we've had spurts of growth rapid growth here and there and just got a hope like bro even me when i was doing my my like the career thing mm, it mm. got to a point where i was like bro like am i kidding myself like what, what's really what's really happening now yeah. what's really mm. good though what's really going on now yeah, yeah and to be fair it got to a point where i was like bro i don't know like i don't know what to do mm. you just wait 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 and then your big break comes so mm. i'm hoping but at the same time you have to be a real like a realist as well mm. and like i think you're you, you're open enough to 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 say this as well if the podcast isn't doing what we want it to do in a couple of years mm. then you reevaluate and you're like okay cool like i tried it i got mm, what i wanted mm, out mm. of it and it is what it is or you just keep going yeah. and you keep going and you keep going and hopefully it just catches on yeah i think it's also a thing of you're a podcaster as well bro like i think it's a thing of like you can't always let numbers be your only like factor do you know what I'm trying to say? Like, but you can't to always say. measure the success it, by numbers. But that's what I'm trying to say. It's it also goes by back impact. to the journey, bro. I swear, it'll grow organically. Like, mm-hmm. let it, let it just do its thing. Yeah, yeah. No, but you sure, can't. But sure. look, if, if if your podcast is not doing what, what it needs to do in a few years' time, mm. you can't just like quit like that. Do you no, know no, what it's mean? not even a thing of it's not doing what it needs to do because me and Hussein see the behind the scenes and I know the impact it has. Yeah, yeah. But some, I think it's that like, bro. Remember when oh, we was okay. trying to when I we was trying to hit a thousand. Uh, when we didn't yeah, have a thousand yeah, yeah. subscribers bro all we wanted was a thousand mm. yeah, yeah so yeah. we could you know turn on you know uh watch our uh, whatever it is you know what i'm trying to say mm. like ads and just just yeah because yeah. a thousand is the first it's a milestone pro- it's proper a milestone. milestone when it yeah. comes to youtube in right and then it was like all right cool then there were times where you know getting a thousand views was like raw thousand views like, that's sick mm. then it got to a stage where alhamdulillah sometimes we get a thousand views within the first like day and a half or something then that was that then you get used to that then you get like 5k subs then you get on this guest then you've upgraded your studio and next thing you know at right. one point 10k just seemed like this oh my god 10k one day and then you get there then you're like mm. but then at the same time like i said numbers can't be your only determining factor because mm. again not trying to make this point because i know we want to talk about yeah. whatever but it's conversations me and you have had if we really wanted to be bigger just for the sake of numbers mm. We'd be those moist, yeah, yeah. Like, I don't want to. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, yeah. there's other things you could do too. We we, to we would numbers. just be number hungry yeah. content creators, collaborating with any and everyone mm. purely because this girl has you know yeah. x amount of followers, or this guy has that many followers, and you know it's like a quick um, yeah, f- fifteen minutes of fame. Let's let's utilize them and. Mm-mm. But then one thing I realized is the difference between building a fan base and a community, and which goes back to what I said earlier. Yeah, we ain't got that many uh, thousands of followers on Instagram and so on and so forth. But like when we put up posts, we mm. get interaction, we get DMs, we get emails, we get, you know what I'm saying? We yeah, get yeah, yeah, genuine yeah. engagement. And I like yeah. to confidently say, Alhamdulillah, I'm so glad that like hate squared supporters aren't moist. Obviously, you're going to get the occasional weird comment here and there but i'm sure you yeah. agree like on, on for the, the most part things, yeah. yeah for the most part yeah let's we'll keep it that way innit? yeah but um yeah anyways on that don't rumor what are you saying no i'm joking <laughs> um <laughs> nah so yeah i was i was i was deep in yeah I was, I was thinking about this the other day yeah actually wait wait hold on, hold on. go on i was a tiktok live in it 
Yeah. Everyone was like, this is the fat version of Donnarumma. I was like, oh. That's very rude. <laughs> you That's get that so comment rude. a lot though. Uh, the, the, not the fat bit. Yeah, but yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of an overweight Donnarumma. I get, I get weird ones. Left, K-Kurd. right, center. You still get K-Kurd? K-Kurd sometimes. I oh get my days, you do look like K-Kurd. All right, let's, let's calm down a little bit. Donnarumma. His voice broke. Um, <laughs> Gianluigi's moving mad. Oh my days! Um, you know you don't clock it until someone mentions yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I got Luke Shaw once as well. Okay. Like Shaw. Footballer. Yeah. Footballer. Yeah. Anyways, right, who saw Liam Payne's? Uh, I, thing? Saw, I saw that. Bro, worst podcast episode I've ever. Bro, that guy. If I see him in person, bro, you see Logan Paul and the man. They whacked. exaggerate what he was saying. He's getting whacked. If I ever see Liam Payne, you don't remove them hands. There's a hide. The and then Logan Paul was like, <gasps> "No way." Yeah. <laughs> You don't remove your hands. There's a high chance, but shut up, man! You was yo, biggest was ever Zane touched that Fair enough, if or Harry group, or one of them man said that, but he's the biggest he, uh... was yo, bro. <laughs> you know, when bro. One do you know how many cringy shit he said that, bro? On my lap, I was driving. I wanted to curl up into a ball. Oh, you watched the thing? I was listening to it whilst I was driving. Oh, okay, cool. I enjoyed the clip. I, I wanted clip. to curl <laughs> up into a ball. <laughs> dude. Wait, wait, wait. Was the whole, was the whole episode as cringy as that clip? Oh, brother, it was so. Bro, he just blowing steam up his own ass. Yeah, yeah. Bro, yeah, yeah. I didn't oh. even need to watch the whole episode. Everything was on TikTok. I was Gee, like, there's no bro, way. he done a Jack Sparrow impression. Yeah, then like, oh no way, ha <laughs> ha. Then he kept doing it, and then ah uh, <laughs> and then Donnie just kept doing the impression. I'm like, bro, allow it now. Wrap this up. Yeah, quickly yeah. I was saying it, I, I was listening to it I was directing it I'm saying wrap this up now trust me while I was what, counting what, down what the was minutes he, what was he saying um, he, that oh Simon took me to the side and basically promised yeah, me yeah, that well, the, the thing the, the, the band would be built around me shut nah, up if it, no, if it was built around anyone it'd be either Zayn basically or, or Harry Harry was yeah, this yeah, is yeah. Big, bro Liam's yeah. the side bro. hey he's got a you with Cheryl Cole yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. he's done his thing shut up and Cheryl Cole judged him to the Fam, yeah, that's yeah, she mad. judged she's a him. She's a massive Do you know why he yeah. said that? The whole uh, Simon Cowell worked around my face. and Because two years before Harry Styles and uh, Zayn Manic joined, didn't it? He was on X Factor. Yeah, he was on X Factor. He got and he was like, based on you, I had an idea to create a boy band, didn't it? But Harry Styles was the one who actually took them off. Yeah, Harry Styles was the one. Yeah, Harry yeah, Styles he the, was the one. He was, he was the yeah. it factor, in my opinion. Oh, Liam Payne's wet. But anyways, he's such a you. <laughs> he's so wet. Yeah, I'll fight Kiss. How many were them all together? Fight your demons. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> he's got problems within himself he wants to fight other people trust actually... me oh my god <laughs> he needs to be I... he so needs to be the I told Chrissy every night bro he's Jeez. got something wrong with him he said it he, s- he literally said like I don't know who I am but you're trying to fight other people gee come on man trust me <laughs> bro imagine demons, yeah <laughs> someone in your band <laughs> puts their hands on you you're not gonna say to them no, no, and what he said. If you don't remove them hands. G, he, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So what did he say? That the guy grabbed him and pushed him against the wall. Yeah, yeah. And apparently, so you're telling me your neck is all like that, yeah? <laughs> yeah and then and there's a high chance. You yeah, trust me, man, you're yeah? doing up Tiggle. You're doing up Tiggle. Man's got you like this. And you're, and you're yeah, the one yeah, friending him. Trust me, trust Allow me. It. That did not happen. <laughs> that did not happen. <laughs> Narnia. That did not happen. Narnia has a better chance of being real. That did not happen. This guy. So you're saying your feet are dangling, yeah? Trust me. Man, feet are dangling. Bro, you're sending threats. Allow it, G. Bro, at that time, he had like Bieber hair, innit? He had the... Yeah, he's a wassio, bro. You can get from Primark. If any of them was bad, it was probably Zayn. Yeah, 100. He had anger problems, apparently. Yeah, trust me. Yeah, Zayn was taken. Yeah, man. They got Bradford. I could believe it was Shout out my brother Zayn Mallet, man. I shout out Bradford as well. Yeah. Well, I don't know about all that, but yeah. Shout out Zayn. But anyways, as I was saying, I was thinking, yeah. <laughs> Donnie lost it. I was thinking. Man said, man said shut up by your demon. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Gee, man said I'm a bit. Ba- he's basically admitted that he's a like, schizophrenic. <laughs> like, he's weird, bro. He's a weird guy, bro. And the p- p- part, and you know what? I can't even lie, yeah. R- r- big up Logan Paul and them, man, yeah. But they were shit that episode. They were so shit. Like they were just, they were just like licking his Bum ass. Licking like, everything he would say. Gee, there were so many times where if I was in that position, mum's life, I would have been like, bro. Shut up, <laughs> like relax, because there was some cringy shit he was saying. They were, they were just <laughs> shut up, man. Yeah. But anyway, mm. big up Liam Payne, man. Even that second guy with Logan Paul, what's his name? The short Mike, guy, oh, bro. He, his voice is jarring. The, the one who rap. always makes the jokes. Yeah, mm. Mike Wazowski. <laughs> yeah, he what's sounds it? like him. What's yeah. his name? You know the little. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah I know. Anyway, yeah, I was cool. deep in it. Yeah, I was just. It was a random. Thing. <coughs> but me and Hader are quite different. You know what? We're different in a lot of ways. Yeah, you're fucking jarring and I'm not. 
That's one aspect of it. I'm funny, you're not. I'm uh, thick. You're thin. <laughs> you get me? Like we're on different sides of the spectrum, but curvy bitches. I think I think it does. We complement each other quite well. Do you get me? I think we work as quite in like contrast as a duo. Yeah, 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 as a duo, we work pretty well together. But anyway, that's fuck that. That's not the point. My point is stop bum licking me. Stop. You are quiet, like. No, I'm good, bro. And this this could be good. For, like it could be a good thing. It could be like, I don't know, innit? But you like you're you're one to to open up. And you know you talk about your issues and you vocal. You're vocal about them. Yeah, like whenever you're going through something, you might give me a little a young ring. You might you know ring someone else and just be like, yo, bro, like what are you saying, blah blah. Man's been through this and that, this and that. Gee, me, yeah, I was deep in it the other day, cause <laughs> fam, I was like. I was going through some stuff and I don't really like it happens in it. Fuck it. I was going through some stuff and I was just like, bruv, there's not one person on earth right now that I can call and tell and like talk to. That's wait, 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 wait. That you That's can't talk mad. to or you don't want to talk to. I don't know. I just, I don't. Because there's a big okay. difference. I don't know if there is though. I think there is. Okay, cool. Let, we're going to get into the discussion now, yeah? An hour later. <laughs> yeah, an hour later. What are, right, <laughs> what do you get yeah we'll we'll, 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 we'll we'll dissect the topic into multiple things yeah mm-hmm. but what do you get out of talking to someone because for me reassurance okay but i don't know if anyone can really relate to what i'm going what, what i've what i've what i'm going through what i've mm. gone through whatever i don't know if there's mm. anyone who can really like for me if i'm going to talk to someone it's just to listen and even then why am i being vulnerable to for, and opening up to you mm. and you could be listening you could be whatever you could just like i could unload off, off my chest but at the same time now you know a bunch of shit about me that maybe I don't want you to know. And maybe if shit mm. goes south, mm. you know. And in my eyes, that's like a, a weapon now you got against me. Like, I don't know. That's I, It might be a fucked way of looking at things, but that's the way I look at it. I I can't disagree with you having that uh, that doubt in it. But before I carry on waffling, what's, what, what are you like in that regard? Are you a vocal person when you're going through shit? Or do you prefer to it just... It depends who I'm, I'm vocal. Yeah. But there are specific people I go yeah. to. Okay, but even then. Gonna but bro, I need. I, all, I was bro, gonna say. I that. always need reassurance. See, I I'll always need it. Here's my thing, yeah. Kind of just bouncing back to what you said a second ago. I am vocal to an extent, mm. but there's a lot of ifs, buts, and maybes involved. For example, I'm not gonna call just anyone about anything. Oh yeah. I'm not gonna just be upset because I've had a bad day at work and just start, you know, oh bro, this happened like. If I'm first of all, if I'm calling someone about something that I genuinely feel like they could, uh, I could benefit from them giving me an input. Like let's say I had a situation at work, colleagues, whatever. I had a, you know, argument at home, parents, w- w- in anything, financial struggles, whatever it may be. Like for example, I don't. Know, I'm trying, just trying to give like a very simple example. Let's say for example. Uh, I'm having issues with my gym progress, for example. Mm. I'll prob- it probably makes sense. And it's a really shit example, but... Maybe you're unhappy with the way you look recently. Yeah, yeah. Or and it makes sense to call someone like yourself who's mm. gone through a weight loss transformation, mm. who's who's who knows a lot about the gym, who can give me an input sort of thing. I wouldn't call, like, someone who's always broke and who's always, you know, counting pennies about financial difficulties well, yeah, or like oh bro man times have just been so hard recently and when my i know my man can't relate I'll, i'd only really go to someone if number one i really trust and respect you mm. and i'll be real like uh, alhamdulillah I, I, I don't know if i, I want to use the word i'm popular but i know a lot of people mm. but just because i know a lot of people like very few people i would consider my friends you know what i'm trying to say mm. like I'm, I, I don't just air my dirty laundry do you get me yeah, so yeah. I, I do so when you say about being vocal, it's it's not as oh upset. Cool. Oh seven yeah, nine. But you, know you still you still go there. Yeah. And you still try to find someone who can yeah who can talk to. And I think yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know, and it goes back to what you said about reassurance. I think it's a thing of like <clears throat> I, I'm I like to pride myself on uh pride myself on being well, I say this but I don't know if people will agree if you, you only uh, only people who aren't me so my friends, family, mm-hmm. so on and so forth will be able to really say it. But I like to pride myself, or I hope I like to pride myself on being a um, like an open-minded and self-aware person. Mm. So I don't mind putting my situation, uh, Hussein, this is, 
this is the shit so situ, yeah? Boom, boom, boom. This is whatever happened, what happened. Tell me honestly, bro, like, is, am I tripping? Am I bugging? Do you know mm. what I'm trying to say? Like, cause I don't, I, and if I am wrong, I want to be able to rectify whatever it may be. You know, let's mm. say I got into an argument with my sibling, for example, or like I had a silly argument with my mum or a falling out. Like, I am here, like, this is a situ, bro. Like, have you ever had that falling out with your mum? And if so, like, you, you know what I'm trying to say? Obviously, examples in it right yeah, now, yeah. but yeah, that's kind of my take on it. I don't know. I, f I feel like if you do that, were you going to say anything? No, 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 no. If you do that, when do you eventually start relying on yourself? Because, bro, imagine any inconvenience in my life. Not any, but you know what I'm trying to say. Mm, to mm. a point where I do feel down or I do feel like I'm going through shit. Oh, man, it's tough times. Because, bro, like, I, like, normally, as a human, you go through that on yeah. a, maybe a weekly basis. Mm. Maybe it's every fortnight. Like, there's no calendar. There's no timer on it. But yeah. it happens, isn't it? It happens yeah, on a regular yeah. basis. Do you, do you kind of... Every time something goes wrong, mm -mm, no, you no. you go and you call someone. Like, no, no, I don't do that. No, no. And no. even like, I don't know, bro. Like, it's not everything. Me, it's not like, I overthink way too much in it. Like, like. But then who deals? Who who sorts that out? Okay, well, it's let's not say, about let, sorting out though. Let's it's say not about yeah. Sorting out. Let's say if I hurt you, yeah. And then I go to I go to you and I'm like, oh man, like I hurt Haydar, man, like like I I need, like I can't I'm, I can't stop overthinking. Mm. And then you're like. Nah, man, he'll be calm, man. Don't worry. I don't want to hear that from him. <coughs> I need to hear that from you. Do you know mm, what I'm saying? Mm. I need that kind of reassurance. Like, if I make a mistake, yeah. the person involved, I need to hear it from them. I can't hear it from anybody else. Okay, but yeah, yeah, yeah I, I hear that. that. I get that. Yeah. I that hear that. That's, that a very, that's a very specific situation yeah, as well, though. Yeah. Like, what if it's just internal struggles? What if you haven't done anything with anyone? It's just internal. You feel like shit. You look like... You feel like you look like shit. Maybe... Your, you get me, like your family's pissing Li like you off. Like things like it's that, I consider career-wise, you feel like you're stagnating. You're not going anywhere. Like there are times where you know when just everything just comes at you in yeah, a, yeah, yeah, in yeah, a yeah, scenario. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Like what for me, bro? I that, can't lie I to you. That re in recent I've times. I've never, yeah, yeah. ever. I don't. I genuinely don't think I've ever called up. I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know if I've ever called someone up. And be like, yo, bro. Like, are you good to talk? Like bruv like just this past like week or this past month has just been the hardest thing like maybe if we're talking and we're on the phone and we're sharing stuff then maybe i might share one or two things but i don't think i've ever just gone out my way and just called yeah, someone yeah. and said i don't know i, that's, I don't know i, I, think I don't know if it's a cultural do you know thing what, do you know what i'm thinking about it now i don't think i've done that you know yeah maybe like it has come up in conversation where they've told me about the day i'm like oh man that happened to me as well like yeah like, this is how i feel as well yeah 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 i don't or it could be a thing of like yo like i just, this is what man's going through right now like have you ever experienced something similar? And if so, like, what's your take on it? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, a minute ago, you sorry, bro, one sec. No, you know, on. you know, you said about um, but what well, when you when do you rely on yourself and like what can they really do for you? I don't think that's how you should look at it, bro. Like, it's not necessarily about oh, I'm only gonna call Amir and speak to him because he's gonna give me solutions. Like, nah, bro. As an adult, as a man, bro, like, you need to rely on yourself more than anyone in this dunya, bro. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Not even mm -hmm. on a cultural thing on a religious thing just as a adult bro like as a man like you've got to be able to you know stand stand tall on your own feet you know what i'm trying to say and regardless of your ethnic background but i don't it's not I, I think i think it's healthy to an extent to be able to you know let mm. let off steam obviously like i said it, it's very gray area you don't like don't air your dirty laundry and and you know mm. your your personal shit stuff that's a very like intimate stuff let's say for example you're married and the, obviously certain things you you don't do that in it mm. but i don't i think every now and then it's it's, it's somewhat healthy in my opinion so don't take this factually in it no, but it's, I, it's I all do, opinion but at the end of the day that's me in it yeah like if you in yourself find it better to just uh i'm going through some shit right now but it's cool i'm gonna keep myself to myself i'm gonna just do my thing maybe go on google see what this scholar says or this lecturer or this historian or this mm. psychologist says or even if it means speaking to someone but more on a professional level but because that person is a professional they're able to give you you know critical uh feedback sort of mm. thing that could also be a route if you feel like you don't feel easy going to your friends and family even then i, pr I probably tried that but i only get to the consultation uh, phase of it it will only get to that part and then it's just i will never progress further than that this isn't a, a a thing of like by the way that's like i need help oh like, no 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 of course this, course this is just, just uh, this yeah, is just opinion realize, like, yeah. i don't think i'll ever change from that i don't think yeah i don't like being vulnerable to whoever do you get me i don't like nah, but and and mm. especially especially all right it's one thing with boys yeah yeah but put yourself now with your missus yeah yeah imagine you got a missus whatever mm. you're with your missus yeah are you gonna tell her you're going through shit as a man i don't know for me personally 
whatever culturally if it's right if it's wrong whatever as a man i feel like and and it's sad because it, w- i don't think it's it's right but i feel like we're just built to like take the load yeah. run with it and just deal with whatever we're no, going that through, could really. also have an impact on a relationship do you know what o- I mean? honestly to give to get, answer your question i think there's a difference between venting and, and sharing what you're going through with your with your girl with your missus compared to you know frankly just being a bitch I think I think it's a very thin line. That's the, my that's my point. It's very interesting you're speaking about this because literally me and my missus we spoke about this a week ago or so. Mm. I never share anything. Yeah. Mm. And we we were having this conversation where she's like, okay, I can see you going through shit because I don't share it as well. I'm like, mm. if I'm going, I'm like, I'm tunnel vision. Head, I'm yeah. Isolated, whatever you know. Yeah. So w- what we came up with is I'll tell her if I'm going through my stuff, mm. then she doesn't bother me. But if we're going through a struggle, if it's in a relationship, yeah. then I'll share it. Well. Communicate, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But like, because I, I just can't share it. I try sharing it, but I just can't. Like, I'm a bit like you. I just yeah, I yeah. don't want to show my like weaknesses. Yeah, yeah. I just mm. want to be like, you know, yeah. sudden. Uh, but I think, That's mad. I think... But the thing what? is, I think... Fuck being vulnerable, bro. No, no, but this is what I'm saying. I, I don't... Obviously, your opinion is your opinion, so I'm mm. not going to sit here and say, yo, you two are wrong for having an opinion. Mm. But I personally... Obviously, if you're watching on YouTube, drop drop your opinion in the comments right now. But I don't think, bro, that's that's you being vulnerable. I don't think that's you know. You said, oh, imagine you telling someone to, something to someone, and then later on, if your friendship falls out, blah, mm. bro. Like, if first of all, if a friendship is gonna fall out, bro, it fall out regardless. Mm. If someone's gonna snake you after you fell out, that 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 was their character all along. So you don't need to worry about whether they're gonna expose your shit or not. Mm. Because at the end of the day. If you told me something out of confidence as your brethren whilst we were good and then God forbid we fell out for a different reason and I start talking shit about the stuff you told me in private, that's just a reflection of my character. Yeah, but that. if you're going through something, bro, I I don't know what you think as well, bro. bro but that's bro, that, I that's don't, your partner. You I have don't to, think oh, bro, you got to tell them. Bro, I don't, I don't think it's vulnerable at all. Obviously, like I said, if you're being... Nah, it's not though, bro. Yeah. Even if it's your partner, opening up is a vulnerable state. Okay, cool. That, no, 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 that's different. Bro, that's that's different. your partner. No, 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 even no, then, no, 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 Bro, and a lot of vulnerable wait, state is different. Yes. And even then, and even then, a lot of girls, yeah, yeah, like they might, and this is this is something that I actually want them to be true with themselves, mm, yeah. Mm. A lot of you girls might actually say, you know what, I actually do want my man to open up to me. But when it happens, yeah, you're not gonna want it. Genuinely, you're not gonna nah. want it. Yeah. When your man starts coming to you and venting to you, your babes, I've been through this and that, and then the next week is the girls same. Girls have shit. actually told me girls, they don't like someone who's vulnerable. Bro, they girl, do or they don't? They don't. Some. Some yeah, have bro, told me they don't like a vulnerable. I, I, man. I feel like it's just some have in told them. Me. Like as a man, you're seen as a man, like as a whole, as an alpha, like you take your nah, shit, you man. keep it stepping, uh, you keep it moving. Bruv, that is not healthy. I though. think that's it's scientific. what has an impact on relationships. I don't I don't think, but I don't think women yeah. can ha- can burden our like thoughts and our feelings and what we're going through yeah. like we can take theirs like we can sit down and understand what they're going through and reassure them and this and that as a man I don't That's feel like right. you can open up no, and no, even no, even if a girl does you, say you're yes at it wrong no but even if a girl does say yes wrong, genuinely even if a girl does say yes and what well, I want my man to open up to me and of course I want him to be vulnerable with me no. trust me when no, it happens no, 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 no. you get the ick no, 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 I, I hear you. I hear you, you and, and, and I'm not gonna disagree. Like, like, big, big girl would say, oh, "I want my man to be, you know, in his emotions and be intact with his emotional." And then side he comes home one day, stuff. like all sad and yeah, crying yeah. in your cool, arms. Cool, cool, cool. But bro, but bro, no. this is one thing I'll say. Not only to you three, and not even to the camera, to anyone who's listening or watching right now. Yeah, if you're in a relationship, man or woman, but obviously because we're men, so to the man them. Mm. If you're in a relationship where you feel you can't be uh, open about what you're going through and quote unquote vulnerable or showing a vulnerable side because bro we're human bro if you that. feel my brother you if i'm in a relationship where i feel if you if, if he called me and told me he's going through something but he he wants to tell his missus about it or speak to her about it because something on his mind and he's concerned about it but you're holding back i oh, hate her i'm holding back because i'm afraid she might think that. i'm wet or she I might straight think up, I'm I come bit. home i'm gonna tell her bro that's what i'm going through but i i would say bro if you have to hesitate about telling the person you're with what you're going through, you're probably not with the right person in my nah, opinion. I don't, th- I don't think it's got to do with them. Sometimes I think oh, it's got to do, do with I... you. But like I said, sorry, sorry, the last point, one well, last point. <laughs> if, if if you're being a bitch about something minor, like, oh, work was stressful today, and oh, I'm just, No, I never done. Uh, I haven't ate anything. Never that, never that. And, uh, I think, I think, I if think you're being can... a baby, then cool. Well, I think it could, it could lead to that. Opening up the first time and getting that reassurance, then the next week getting that reassurance. I think eventually you will naturally just be like, you know what, I can tell this person everything. And then eventually you'll just unload literally everything to that person. And it just becomes like, you're just, you start, Bro, men, mo- you men start can becoming burst. a bitch. Men can actually burst. If you keep it all inside yourself, eventually you're going to burst. I think that's fine. 
I think you can burst sometimes. Nah, it's and not just fine, bro, bro. It's not good. Bro. That's literally that's, that's my outlet. Some that's my outlet. That's outlet, bro. That's my outlet. Bro. That's my outlet. Bro. Listen, that's, I'm not gonna burst on my misses and that. Yeah, you go, go. To an extent, everything I'm saying is within but within yeah, within yeah, measures, within reason. Share, the relationship and she kind of respected when I explained it to her is if she's going through shit, and mm. if I'm going through shit, and then I'm offloading my shit on top of her shit. Mm. Nah, it becomes a bit like you know. That's true. May, maybe if the other person isn't like having a perfect life about any issues, yeah, it's cool. Mm. But, but no one's having a perfect life. Exactly. No one's having a perfect but sometimes life. Sometimes I feel like, and maybe it's all overthinking for but like you have so much stuff going on. Okay. It has no deal with the other person. You're kind of sharing it to him and putting force on him and making yeah, yeah, yeah. him more depressed. No, but, like but sometimes opening yeah. up doesn't necessarily... Like, opening up doesn't necessarily mean our babes, are like, and start shedding tears and start crying and that. Sometimes it can just be, like, yo, like, bro, my work stress is just... It's getting mad, like... Mm. Like, you know, I'm trying to manage my time and my manager's giving me beer and, like, I've got this deadline to meet... You know, like, it could, it could be... It's it's not even that deep, but you just you're human, bro. Like, if, no, I hear that. I, I I don't know. I don't think everyone's don't... different in it, but I don't like. I keep on emphasizing. If you're crying about every minor thing in your life to your to your girl, then come man up, bro. Like, stop being a little bitch. No, bro. no, no, but no. Like, it's ne- never that, never that. Yeah, I don't think. That. No, I'm not talking about that extent. I'm just talking about the major, major. Yeah, yeah. 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 But I if okay, if it's like Eric was saying, if it's something to do within the relationship, best thing to do is communicate. If I'm feeling a certain way because of you, or you're feeling a certain way because of me, or there's something in our relationship, communicate. Yeah. But I'm talking internal struggles that I f- I deal with myself, whether you are alive or not, or whether you exist or not. I'm gonna deal with them. I don't feel like just. Sp- like saying them to whoever or saying it to someone mm-hmm. you trust or whatever enough, I don't Fair think enough. it helps that much I genuinely don't think society as a whole is built to listen to men like that anyway and you've seen it in the past where a man does open up he's taken for a, a yeah, mu- he like he's a taken, meme. He's taken for a meme right. or yeah, he's, he's taken or even like bro how could you let a woman hit you or whatever like yeah, it, yeah. We're, we're built to take it keep science. it moving yeah. and khalas like that's it and then that's why a lot of guys that like, you'll see bro like as soon as someone asks him like how are you actually doing bro mm-hmm. that man breaks down bro he starts like he, all the shit that he's held in for so long, finally breaks down and just lets loose. But, I don't but, think that's but healthy, man. There you go. But but if if you were someone that was a bit more open with what you're going through, I think it, I think it trains you. But th- doing that as well, I think it trains you to be. A, I was gonna say be a bitch, but I think it trains you to be a bit moany. If every single no. thing that I'm going through, I'm, I'm no no no, no. I'm you're right you, you're right you're right I agree in that in that yeah. in that regard in capacity if you're complaining about every little thing to your girl, bro of course over time bro does this guy ever yeah, fucking give Child, it or yeah. put a sock in it mate yeah you're always crying bro allow it bro that's what I'm saying but bro if you're going through some mad mental health issues and you know your work is stressing you well, out that's and different yeah. you're unhappy with your financial bro like. But by the way, you this need is to all be able to speak. Yeah, no, but that's wait, what I mean. Sorry, you have to open up about that. You can't keep that in. Quick disclaimer, yeah. I'm just talking mm. as someone who doesn't suffer from mental health. If you actually suffer from depression, anxiety, exactly. loneliness, intimidation, intimidation, that. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Please tell me, please tell me you know where that's from. No, 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 no. no. Oh, where? If you I'll show them after, I'll show them after. If oh, you, if, man, if I used you, to take six pills a day. Now no, I'll no, take no, one. relax, relax. If you are genuinely someone who suffers from um, depression or all, any actual mental health. You're rude. Like, genuinely, like, do seek help. I'm not telling you keep it in. Like, genuinely seek help because that, you could potentially lead yourself to, to the end. I really I'm just place, saying, yeah. I don't suffer from mental health, quote unquote. I'm not going to diagnose myself with depression because I'm depressed for like, or I'm sad for like three weeks or whatever. That's what it is, what it is. But I'm saying as a person with a normal mental state who mm. goes through shit on a daily basis, weekly basis, whatever, I think as a man, mm. it toughens you. Yeah, of course, of course. That's yeah. fine. That's keep it, fine. Keep that's it fine. But another, another thing is, and this is also something that's, uh, I'm, I'm liking, especially in recent times, mm. is like sometimes I feel like, even if someone's asking me like, "Yo, what's up, bro?" Like we saying, even if I am going through something, a lot of the times it's, 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 it sounds a bit negative, but you lot will hear it, yeah. Like, not not in a not in a like a selfish way, but I know if I'm going through something, and I and and if I know me talking to this person or whatever the situation is, if I know really and truly, like with all due respect, no one can really do anything for me. And it, the situation is just what the situation is, and like mm. the cards are that like, I've got the hand that I've been given. Then, like you said, yeah, bro. Sometimes you just gotta suck it up and just just do your thing, bro. You get me? You can't always like 
you know, be moaning as you said and, yeah. and just whining all the time. Like you've got a you've got a man up and just be like, all right, cool. Sometimes, I don't. I don't feel like shit happens. I don't feel like as a man. Like again, I'm saying this as from the point of view of a man. I think from a woman, it's completely different. For, but as a point of view from a man, mm. I don't think like I said the way we're all constructed and the way that we're, we're all built and the, we all like think and act and whatever. I don't think society and humanity as a whole is dealt or is built in a way to take our shit. Because let's let's be honest, if men were to actually speak on what they go through and what burden they take for, for them, for their family, whatever, there's a lot of shit that we can talk on and be like, yo, like I'm going through this and I'm going through that, whatever. Expectations. Yeah, but stuff, yeah, exactly. Yeah. But we just keep it moving and, yeah. and, and done. Do you get me? And I, I, I feel like that's how we're designed and I feel like that's, I'm not saying it's the best way, it's the healthiest way, mm. but I feel like that's that's just the way that's that we know. Designed. That's your way, yeah. 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 When you go like combat. If I'm going through something, I'll go for like a good two hour session. Yeah. I'll come out fresh. I'll be like, my yeah, it's true. Because you go into such a physical, you get tired physically. You're yeah. thinking about what's in your head. Mm, mm. Meditation. Of course, of course. It's true. Yeah, meditation, no, no, I agree, bro. Uh, I agree. Prayer. Prayer. There's, there's, there's. Uh, I'm not. Walk, that's oh, what I'm saying. Is I'm the not best saying. way, you know. Gee, I'm not. Yeah, going for a walk, listen to a podcast, oh. whatever. Just not the Logan Paul one. Like, <laughs> as long as you're, li- <laughs> like, you, like, whatever <laughs> you're doing, yeah, whatever you're doing, like, I'm not saying keep it all in, and because mm. eventually you're gonna turn into a nuclear, nuclear disaster. Gee, yeah, I'm just saying, find an outlet. Find an outlet. Yeah, it, yeah. Your yeah. outlet doesn't. Okay, this is what I'm trying to say. Your outlet mm. doesn't have to be talking. And sharing. Your outlook could be gym. Your outlook could be MMA. Uh, Your agree, outlook agree, could agree, be agree, agree, agree. podcasts, agree. Walks, walks, runs. Yeah. Jogs, yeah. That's, that could be an outlook. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. And, course, that f- course. and scientifically, that does actually help. No, I'm not saying it doesn't, but I, I think it is, it, just my opinion, I've never done no, like, scientific research, so don't quote me on this, but we're humans, we're, we're made to be interactive and, yeah. what's the word, bro? Like, we're, we're made to... Intermangle. What? Intermangle? <laughs> Intermingle, whatever it's called, yeah. bro. We're, we're, we're like we're we're social creatures, in it. I know introverts, extroverts, and people may be like whatever, whatever. But generally speaking, I do feel if you keep everything to yourself and think, oh, if I let any sort of vulnerable side of me out, then like my girl's gonna rape me less or whatever. I, I don't. If I'm in a if I'm in a situation with a girl where me saying something about what I'm going through, obviously within reason, of course, mm. like makes her rate me less or get mm. as you said get the ick or whatever you said mm. then I, you, you're probably just not the person for me yeah. then, bro. In, my, in my opinion I, 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 I'm I'm, see, see the thing is in my manhood in my opinion I, I'm secure in myself I don't like I don't care I don't need a six pack and big muscles to feel like a man or I don't I don't need to be able yeah. to fucking build a house from you know two planks of wood for me to you know what I'm trying to say like my yeah, manhood yeah. comes from my, my core values my beliefs and what I'm achieving right now and what I have achieved and yeah I hear that you I get what I'm saying but again going back to that point I just feel like women as much as they will tell themselves that I do want my man to yeah, open up course. and this blah blah yeah I do feel like when it actually push comes to, sh- to shove and when mm-hmm. it actually does happen I would love for uh, for for some girls in the comments or whatever yeah. to actually be realist and and just actually be honest with truth, us yeah and don't just do it because you're politi- you're trying to be politically, politically correct, correct yeah and do it for whatever yeah. but genuinely if a man was to open up to you on a regular basis or whatever eventually it drains you because I know women go through shit as yeah, well of course of course so of course. eventually it does drain you and yeah. I feel like as I don't know. Maybe it goes back to our culture and what what we're used to. Mm. But I'm sure your pops didn't complain to your mum all the time. I'm sure your pops didn't come and complain to you. I'm sure your brother didn't come and complain. Like, I don't know. That's that's just I, I I feel like that's how we're built. But again, we do have a platform and we do have a responsibility. Mandem, if you are going through stuff and you yeah. feel like you are about to burst and whatever, yeah. either find an outlet. Yeah, yeah. yeah? Find or a way to release all that help. energy or all that stress or whatever. And like I said, the uh, gym, jogging, uh, yeah, combat, running, whatever yeah, it might be, yeah. or if you feel like you know what I'm actually going through something deeper, then talk to someone. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm, not to, I'm not here. I'm not here to yeah, say yeah, yeah. listen, man. Them keep it in, and then one don ends up doing something. Yeah, mad. yeah. Like, there's not, nothing not wrong with like it, like like seeking professional help, and we 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 we've spoken about it, bro. We've spoken about it, bear, bro. Like it's, there's, there's nothing there's nothing wrong with being in a vulnerable position. Yeah. But obviously, you know, if if you're going through a lot and you're, there's no element of letting it out to anyone, even if it's Mandem letting it out to their mandem or yeah. mandem letting it out to their missus or their siblings, their parents, whatever. Like, even the sisters, like, don't think that, like, because, because, bro, like, although genetically women are more obviously uh, emotional uh, beings. Whoa, like, you about to say a madness. 
what creatures, creatures. Yeah. Yeah, yeah i'm not gonna lie i was yeah about to, but i think yeah. that's normal yeah it's calm we, we are creatures though Everyone's we are, creatures, yeah, yeah we're creatures you know what i'm trying to say but obviously to an extent i do also know or have assumed what happened no no that women also can feel like oh am i am i overloading my man with too much of a burden or whatever mm. but uh, I, I do like to think you know there should be in any healthy relationship boyfriend girlfriend marriage whatever fling situationship yeah, whatever you know what I'm trying to say yeah. but what if you're actually yeah. going through deeper stuff you do seek help yeah mm, but the girl is a bit like this guy is very vulnerable I can't be with this guy well that's then then see that's yeah. then you could say what Hila said maybe you're not with, with the right person mm. I don't feel like if you open up to your girl and over time she's like babe like I'll be honest with you like I hear you but this is draining me as well. If she says that, I don't. I personally don't think that's that's a red flag. I think she's just being real. I think she's just being a human, whatever. But if you've said, babe, I'm going through depression. I've been mentally diagnosed with mm-hmm. depression. Doctor has said it. He's written it. Like, I've, I've yeah, got it on my yeah, record. Yeah, yeah. Like, I've gone to see a professional. Yeah, and yeah, you're yeah. telling me now, pack it in. Yeah. Then you yeah. were not made for each other. Yeah, cool. you're like, prick, yeah. yeah. You were just not made for but each like, other. But give me an example of something, what you mean. Like you said X, Y, Z to your partner or in this, in, a, in a scenario. I haven't been in this scenario. Situ- no, 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 in a fake scenario. Make a fake scenario. So no, it's like actually going through deeper stuff. You put all the burden on your significant other in it. And she's like, maybe go see someone. And then, yeah, like the doctor has written that you've been diagnosed with depression. But then again, you go back to her and she's like, I don't really like. Girls are just not, into, some girls are just not into vulnerable men. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So she's like, yeah, I've got to move away now. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, it could happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it is. I bro, I I think it's deep in the society. I think it's how we are. I think it's literally how we're built. Men can handle more, other people's yeah. burdens more yeah, than yeah, a woman. Yeah. That's why naturally the man is the uh, the man is the head of the the family, head of like whatever. He takes all the burdens, the kids, pr- job, work. I'm I'm so, uh, the only salary in, but also like I have to you know look after my parents, and I also have to look after my family. Like you just taking a lot of a lot of yeah, shit, yeah. and it piles on. And I feel like we can, mm, mm. but. Yeah, I don't know. I would yeah, love, I would yeah. love for someone to actually come in. Yeah, no, of course, because I, 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 I do feel it's a very case by case scenario. What is it that you're complaining about? How long have you been complaining about it? Yeah. Is it, is it just you being a little bitch? Yeah, yeah, yeah at, of course, Or are yeah. you like my guy? You're actually going through something and you need to. Like, oh, babe, there was bad traffic today. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or oh my god, in the, in you know, at work today, I couldn't get the queue was long for yeah. lunch and I had to you cut it down by half an no, hour. Oh, never she, she didn't put enough beans in my jacket. Yeah, potato. trust me, trust me. <laughs> I asked for grated cheese and she gave me yeah. sliced. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there's no mozzarella left. Trust me. Oh, <laughs> me. Man's no mozzarella. I asked for a Coke. She gave me a Sprite. Yeah, trust. Babe. They didn't have the fucking Coke Zero and Diet Coke. Those obviously. kids are the type of kids, yeah, to slap them up and put a butt on their toast. That's what I'm saying, bro. Trust me. <laughs> I'm breeding them from young. Trust me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I but Loki, if I didn't open up to my mom, she probably just told me to wash the dishes. Trust, <laughs> bro, I, I don't, I've, I don't think I've ever opened up to my mom. No, bro, yeah. never. My dad, I could. <laughs> <laughs> that, bro, that conversation doesn't that. Like, like you know where there's options for conversations. Yeah, imagine you're playing a game. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, not yeah, even yeah. an option. <laughs> like that option doesn't even exist. That character could not be unlocked. Ever. Bro, <laughs> a game malfunction error four or four. What do you mean? Must be error son, four or four. son talking <laughs> to father. Oi, if you open up to your dad, yeah, all you hear is like AOL. Yeah, 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 imagine. NTO, imagine. Dial up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> imagine you, oh, you, you open up to your uh, the Windows theme song starts playing. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> just does that. G. <laughs> imagine you open up to your pops and you just start. You just like, G, come off it, man. Pass me, bro. Come off it, man. <laughs> But at the same I, time, dads like that. You know? No, 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 bro. It's same, <laughs> Asian, bro. It's same Asian parents as well, bro. Don't African, get I'm pretty sure, like, yeah, come on, African, sure African yeah, yeah, parents, yeah, yeah. Asian parents, like, you're depressed. Russian, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah. Gee, come on, man. Bro, you bro, can't bro, open bro, up to bro, what? Open bro, up to my dad. Hey, but do you reckon our generation? So when you have kids, do you reckon you'll be like that as well? Yeah. Swear down. Swear down. I think I'll be more. Like, all right, cool. I think w- the difference between me and my dad is that I understand what mental health is. Like, I understand if he's actually. Oh, yeah, yeah, so, if yeah, my yeah. ute comes there up to go. me and says, Lo, dad, like, I actually feel like I'm going through something deeper, then cool. But if he comes to me, that, like, bro, I feel like the past two weeks, like, work has been. Like, that, I don't think that conversation will ever exist. Like, as sad as it is, like, I don't know. I don't feel like that conversation. Right, cool. I don't feel like that conversation should be between a. I don't know, maybe. I don't know. It's, bro, you can't blame me for thinking the way I'm thinking if. I've been brought up the way I've been brought up. I'm not blaming you because at the end of the day, bro, if 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 that's your coping mechanism and it makes sense to you and it works for you, mm. then no one in this room, no one in this world can... What are you keep on doing? 
Just moving this way. All right. But wait, no one can like tell you you're wrong for that, innit? Yeah, but I think I think I would raise my son in a way where I would teach him how to deal with that stuff before he has to come to me and talk to me. That's my that's my that's my that's my yeah, of course. But but that goes back to just bro, like we're we're all ethnic minorities here, like about being a man, bro. Yeah. Like again, if you're complaining about a jacket potato or like. You know, oh, it's really cold today. <laughs> well, and, well, oh, that, my, I got wet in the rain. Like, bro, fuck off. No, but man. there has like, been some progression up. from my, our parents' generation and to our, our generation. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So, for yeah, example, yeah. my mum, bro, like, I remember I would say, I would literally, like, finish five days of work. I come home that night after gym or whatever. She's like, oh, I'm tired. My mum would literally say, you know, Ayeb. Oh, yeah, yeah. It means, like, it's, like, kind yeah, of, like, yeah, yeah. rude, embarrassing. She'd be like, it's embarrassing for you to say, like, don't, you're a man. Don't say you're tired. Like, what are you talking about? I'm like, mum, are you are you serious? Yeah, yeah. Again, bro, like, same, it's not same, her fault. Same, same, it's not same. her fault. But I'm like, brother, are you serious? Like, I'm allowed to be tired. But oh my god, has that's happened to me so many me, times. Bro. That's that so bare time. Sorry. How, oh shit. How long we got left on that? R.I.P. Not long. All right, cool. We'll wrap yeah, it up in about five minutes. Yeah, we'll, we'll wrap it up. Bro. Quick. Yeah, mm. I think that's a progression. Like, there has been progression. Don't get me wrong. From generation to generation. Just to just to add on to your point, like yeah. I'll say, oh mum, be tired, man. Like. You know, you know the the central London commute. Like even if you're not even travelling that far, but just the you know tapping in, mm-hmm. getting the tri- the walk in. It just it can just get tiring, innit? It's like, mashallah, like hey, there, like you're a young guy. Like why you feel? Yeah. Would you, uh, I I know I'm a young guy. Like like what? Can well, I not be tired, yeah. mum? They used to like camel journeys and Trust shit. Like, me, where man. Used to, like, Trust metropolitan me. line being delayed a little bit. Oh while, my while god. The met line gets on my nerves, yeah. bro. Big up met line. I got to take the northern line sometimes. Yeah. But northern lines alright. Hardly. I've delayed. never used it, you know. But decent, anyway, decent. good discussion, man. Yeah, uh, I wish it could be longer. We ultimately, waffled, we offered a lot. Yeah, trust me. Ultimately, um, don't be a little bitch. Yeah. Obviously, to an extent, of course. Find your out. Listen, but all I'm going to say is yeah. find your outlet. Yeah, yeah. 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 Don't complain Agreed, about yeah. every little, tiny, minor inconvenience. Words should be, as a man, I think, personally, don't take my advice. Maybe Hader thinks differently. I think words should be final like uh, option. Mm. Yeah, final solution. Unless you feel like you're going through something deeper. That's my that's my two cents. My two cents would be. By the way, I'm for mo- eighty percent of it. We kind of agree in a yeah, little yeah. bit. Yeah, yeah. All I'm trying to say is, uh, the only thing that I would say I distinctively probably disagree with is the whole partner vulnerability. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, of I course, of course, within reason. If you're being yeah. like a proper waste man and you're just well, crying yeah. over every small minor thing, yeah. then of course, bro, man up, bro. Your girl's got bigger balls than you right yeah, now, yeah, and that doesn't yeah, even make sense. But yeah. obviously, if you feel like that respect gets you, lost eventually. yeah 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 of course but if you feel that you can't have certain conversations with your significant other mm. because you're afraid and intimidated that they may lose respect for you or like they may see you less of a man mm. then yeah I don't know about that one G you gotta maybe reassess who you're with mm. and any final thoughts bro I agree with both of you from that. what a guy I agree man said no be. beef just I agree. choose one you know what I'm trying to say honestly just spot on I yeah, man. Like but on. big up on coming through, bro. I yeah, know find your outlet right now. Find your outlet. Find your find your outlet. Find your outlet. And uh, yeah, the emoji of the week is a trolley. And what was it? A cart. A trolley. Leave cart, yeah. your comment of the week, people. Whatever it is. Actually, we've had a long discussion. Yeah, yeah we spoke. Pick about a part a of the discussion today, yeah, and give us lot. your uh, give us your opinion. Whether it be a review, whether it be a comment, leave your thing. Manscape twenty percent off. Free shipping worldwide. You just hate um, squid. You just hate squid, bro. Like, don't be wet. Look Trust after your sack. Me. Your sack will look after you in the future. Sack and maybe stuff. you'll have kids and you'd raise them properly, not to be a little bit now. Yeah, trust me. Not to vent and keep things bottled up like, like, like this guy. Yeah, just go gym, man. Don't, <laughs> be don't let go of those hands. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>